Previously, I'm back pocket. But it's far away. It was far away. I miss Jeff. So do the Wiggles. Grand Theft Auto. Grand Theft Auto is correct. Mega Man. Redfall. Super Hot. God of Warcraft. Sonic. Super Smash Brothers. Okay, man. Artificial comfort. Uh, most nights. Scissor Luigi? <laughs> <laughs> Where hottest means the character with the most Rule 34 artwork in the internet's largest database of Rule 34 content, and notest means the least. <laughs> Mummy, sorry, Mummy? I yep. do feel like the furries might ruin us. Oh, that's just, no. Uh, <laughs> those are words that just came out of your mouth, Panacasio. <laughs> <laughs> from several homes and the Loki studio on this Thursday, the 18th of January, 2024. This is the finale of season three of Pocket Pals and it's starring... He listed himself as, quote, the pretty one on the intake form. It's Gus Ronald. He's Jep when he can get it and he can get it tonight. It's Jep. Last year, her highlight of Pocket Pals was being called a, quote, Fucking nerd by her team captain. Let's see if Gus can top that tonight. It's middle C. She told me at PAX that her brain's been replaced with a dog's brain. And not just any dog's brain, a dumb dog's brain. It's Ruby Innes. He's not gonna fool me this time. It's syntax, end quote, close parentheses, semicolon, drop table users. Wait, damn it, he got me again. She's the queen of hearts, but can she be the queen of points tonight and claim a victory cr victory royale crown for real? It's Liz Dahlia and me tonight on the show. We find out once and for all which is the superior team. Hey, chat. Thanks for joining us for Pocket Pals, not just for tonight, but for this whole season. Uh, Back Pocket's back next week, but until then, we've got one very important job to do, and that's to close out season three of Pocket Pals by finding out once and for all which team is our overall winner. This is the last of three weeks that the full Back Pocket team are on their end of year holidays, and each year they hand the keys to the channel over to me to keep up the community spirit while they're away. If you are not familiar with Pocket Pals, this is a game show spectacular where two teams go head to head with one another to battle it out for supremacy across a gauntlet of six games. Last week's result tied it all up. Ready. Team Quantum, you ended up on nice, 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 69 nah. points. <laughs> <laughs> team That's you my team. 64 oh. points. Yes! Yes! A win for Team Quantum tonight. Let's go. Congratulations. Well Congratulations. done, guys. Yeah, well done. Well done. It well was done. the fairies. <laughs> yeah, it was the fairies. was the fairies. I'll take a win from the fairies. Team <laughs> Quantum took victory by beating Nintendo 64 by the next best number. And tonight we've stacked the teams with an all-star crew. We've got Gus and Ruby, two Pocket Pals first-timers leading the teams. So with them, I have put four returning juggernauts, but we'll get to that shortly. In a moment, we're going to spend a little bit of time getting to know our two teams teams and then we'll jump straight into tonight's games. My name is Nick Belling aka Nicrotex and once again for the final time this season I am your Pocket Pals host. Last year um, I managed to finish a grand total of three games so I don't know if I'm qualified to do this really but I'm the only one stupid enough to say yes uh, but after tonight I am looking forward to getting started on the old backlog. I, I have uh, this app on my phone um, that shows me all of the um, games that I have yet to finish. Uh, let me just line that up. And it's a lot. Um, obviously, I've got to get into Baldur's Gate 3 at some point, but I also want to smash out some of the other big ones from last year, like Liza P, uh, Stray Gods, Sea of Thieves, uh, Bramble, Cocoon. Uh, then there's a whole bunch of uh, like indies that I missed, like Slay the Princess, This Bed We Made, uh, Lucifer Within Us, Soma, The Banished Vault, uh, Chance of Sanar, God, so many. Um, then there's older ones that I want to get to, like uh, Signalis and Eternal Threads, 
Tunic, I've never played. Road 96, I've never played. Um, Ghost Ghostwire Tokyo just went free on Epic the other week. Um, don't tell Ruby, but I bought and not played We Love Katamari. I still haven't played The Sexy Brutal, and that's a time loop game. That's entirely my shit. Um, and that's just the games that are already out. We're about to get um, Last of Us Part 2 Remastered, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, a bunch of Switch exclusives like Mario vs. Donkey Kong, Princess Peach Showtime, Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Let's hope nothing I just said will be important later. Anyway, that's enough about me. Pocket Pals is that is possible thanks in no small part to the content team. All of these people are my ride or dies and boy howdy have they cooked up the goods tonight. Their help not only broadens the content that you see this year but also allows me to focus on enhancing the technical aspects and overall experience of the show. They produced way more content than we were able to fit into these three episodes as well as pitched whole new games that we weren't able to fit into the show so there's plenty more to come in the future. Um, so for the final time this season I want to extend a massive thank you to fourth reaper cross buns dolphin pants everay lesser of two weevils maiden muse and meadow and of course the coastal city whose artistic brilliance crafted the season three pockets on top of gus's amazing original design um without further ado though i think it's time to look take a look at the two teams who are going head to head tonight which of course means it's time that i choo choo choose to subject everyone to this monstrosity again <laughs> I'm here with Gus, who's leading Team Inferno tonight. Hey, buddy. G'day, mate. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I, I'm fantastic. And I just want to start by saying again, uh, from everyone who will say this as well, thank you so much for all the amazing amount of effort you put into these episodes and tonight's as well. I am going to give you one bit of a critique though. It's the, it's the no lead in on that graphic. It just starts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it yeah. It just fucking starts. I love it. And that cut. train just barrels <laughs> out at you. It's the stuff of nightmares. I've actually had that theme stuck in my head for like the last two days, but I don't know the words. So I've just had like big, <laughs> that's the only part i know head. too <laughs> that's so i've had that running through my head as some form of preparation but uh otherwise everything else that i've been watching i've been enjoying the previous episodes of this and uh watching my teammates my team inferno teammates and uh i just again can't thank you enough for your, your bloody good effort and everyone else behind the scenes you guys are doing such a great job oh thank you so much and uh yeah well this is not long until you guys are back properly so um yep, that will be yep. all good to go we we are wearing things back up on our end and it's lovely to have a team around and then i watch you and you're like even though you've got that team just furiously putting things together at the last minute some say because people haven't prepared what they'd like to give you to put in at the last minute but <laughs> the point fingers come on let's not do that um well, on your team tonight, we've got uh, two returning faces. Uh, shall we bring them in? Uh, I've... Let's do it. Yeah, yeah. Do I do I have to do do something before they show up? No, bring them in. Just bring, bring them in, in first, mate. Just All bring right. them in. Okay, them in. Here, here they are. <laughs> we've got Jeff and Middle C on Team Inferno tonight. Hey, Welcome to the two of you. <laughs> Welcome back, I should say. Um, how are we doing? Um, I made the mistake of... Um, improving a my intro and uh i'm pretty sure everyone saw me spill my espresso martini on my keyboard in the intro <laughs> so I'm, fine I, drink choice though so. apart from that pretty good <laughs> amazing uh see how are you well i didn't spill any of my drink on my keyboard i just accidentally <laughs> drank half of it so we're gonna have a great time tonight everyone <laughs> yep. cool cheers to um, that um no, we, we had a little chat before the thing went live and uh, we've discussed some tactics. I mentioned previously I've been playing mind games with Ruby in the office to try and throw her off, telling her how much we've prepared. The mind game is that we haven't prepared at all. Um, but I did just thought it would be lovely to get on with these guys and just kind of like, we didn't plan anything. Like we haven't, we're all just like, I don't know what what's everyone, is anyone wearing team colors or anything? No, we're just in like the usual stuff. I mean, team Inferno. It, it, yeah, exactly. It's mm. that kind of thing. But um, oh, you guys smell? You smell a bit of a bit of smoke. Does anyone smell smoke? I think definitely oh. smell smoke. Yeah, oh. Oh. oh, well, where there's smoke, there's fire, and I think King of Pearl <laughs> Temple. Nice. Seriously, everyone. All right. Team of Pearl. 
<laughs> we all brought hats too, we don't know how to wear them. This is, if anyone wow. asks, this is hat. Wow. King Inferno Assemble. <laughs> Amazing. Did, did, is, this a, is this a Gus original shirt as well? Uh, we are all sporting from the back pocket fire department for Team Inferno. Uh, there we are. Custom t-shirts. Wow. Uh, and wow. Uh, we're here to be sexy firemen and women. Ow. Don't do that. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. That well, the, uh, I'm pretty sure you guys definitely win uh, best uh, team intro uh, so far. Uh, I yeah, love right. that. I love that. Um, uh, I, I had no idea how long that sound effect that you gave me was going to go for because I didn't get to play it before we started. But here we are. <laughs> I also had I had smoke. I had fire overlays. Things I didn't prepare in time, but I think that that did us ju that that did us justice. And that look how good we look. Yeah, uh, ch uh, chat loves it. <laughs> Avexia just said, shit, I bet on quantum. Can I take it back? Um, <laughs> so, uh, cool. Well, speaking of uh, betting and teams for tonight, um, we, this is a, a trivia show about video games. Uh, and you guys submitted to me some interesting games, although Gus's were entirely predictable. <laughs> Gus, your I top know. five games you've listed as Dark Souls, Breath of the Wild, Ocarina of Time, Halo, and Goldeneye. Would you say you're a that lot of lot of Zelda in there, a lot of Nintendo uh, originals? Um, you are you are I, a I, Nintendo and Rare kid from way back. I was. I never. I always like to like throw in interesting answers if anyone gives me a survey, a questionnaire, or something. But I was like, I'm not gonna come up with games that I don't know anything about. Like yeah. when I think about it, those are the games that I, I, that I think about in my dreams that I always want to go back and play. And those are the ones, yeah. Uh, Zelda is just something I will go back to all the time. And then I thought about it. I was like hours played. It's like Dark Souls and like Goldeneye, even just playing it recently. I was like, I know every inch of that game. I hope at least if there's questions about it. So yep. Those are the ones there. Just the, the classics, the faves. I am milk toast when it comes to game games that people love. So yeah. Yeah, yeah. And Jep, um, we've got uh, a lot about you, but I would like to give you the opportunity to tell us a little bit about yourself uh, just before cool. we dive into that, just in case anyone in the audience doesn't know you. Cool. Um, so by day, I do web development, software development. Um, by night, a uh, little bit of, <laughs> yeah, five fires. Um, <laughs> a little bit of streaming but i haven't recently i do want to get back into it this year um uh, i'm interested in singing and voice acting i've done like a little bit of each but not like too much yet um and then just spilling drinks onto my keyboard That's my new hobby <laughs> well you revealed yourself to be the uh mysterious user who had been submitting a lot of uh anonymous songs <laughs> as words from our sponsors to the back pocket channel uh any similar yeah. uh massive reveals for us tonight are you banksy um i could never reveal that <laughs> Cool, cool. Um, well, in your top five games, you listed Doom 2, Half-Life 2, Neon White, Terraria, and a game that I had never heard of, Viscera Cleanup Detail. What is that? Um, so my case for this is that it's the um, so Power Wash Simulator. It's been picking up a lot of steam lately. Yep. And in my opinion, Viscera Cleanup Detail is like the original Power Wash Simulator. Ah, a bit okay of a grim sort of setting but it's the one um, where you go it's you go through levels after like a doom character has gone through a level and killed everyone and you clean up after them right yep yeah exactly yeah amazing <laughs> yeah really cool um opportunities for crossovers they did one with Sh uh, shadow warrior it's like the first level in shadow warrior that you have yeah to right um, that was a bloody game and then they did like a christmas one where it's like santa's workshop but some chaos has happened in there that um would be a bloody yeah. scenario yeah, cool. Uh, yeah. Um, nice. Well, uh, let's move on to C. Hello. How are you? Hi, I am so well. I'm so excited to be back again. Thank you so much for having me. Of course. And um, you were with us last year on last year's finale. You're joining us again for a finale again. Um, do you, for those of us who don't know you though, would you like to give us a quick intro? Sure. I am C, middle C, or Chloe. I um, generally prefer not to be perceived, so I don't stream. Um, but I am in chat a lot and 
also this is trivia and trivia is always an exception for me um i'm the back pocket community's third favorite lawyer behind bori bori and tom hama hama um <laughs> and i i just really love you guys Oh, That's the gym. oh, well, you're, <laughs> you're our favorite lawyer on stream tonight, unless there's something I don't know about Ruby. Um, you, uh, listed on your top games, Dragon Age Inquisition in your number one spot, uh, Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, Pokemon Silver, Final Fantasy Tactics and Horizon Zero Dawn. That's a big sort of, uh, spread. Um, what sort of got you into gaming? What's what what got you started and going and what do you what do you generally love to play also i forgot to introduce my dog albie who is <laughs> moving around <laughs> on the bed behind yay me. hi albie i feel like that's probably crucial information because he just sort of looks like a scary black shadow otherwise <laughs> is that um, he's making the noise yeah yeah he's okay, chosen good. exactly the right time to start talking sorry um he's like no, i would right. like to be perceived <laughs> 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 speak for yourself mate i want to be on the on, on stream this is my big break um uh i loved i was given a game boy very very happily given a game boy when i was like five years old pokemon blue taught me to read um pokemon red and... taught me to read amazing <laughs> and look at us now and look at us now <laughs> we're in opposite colored uh, boxes <laughs> we did it um i just i love a good chunky rpg but i also love a shooter i've like being in this community has actually really opened me up to lots of different genres of gaming and um even though a lot on that list are like big rpgs like a lot of people in the back pocket community know me from our destiny clan um or final fantasy 14 so um i just like just like to get my teeth into uh whatever my friends are playing and i just love a good adventure yeah nice all right well um i'm gonna jump over and speak to the other team but best of luck to you guys tonight um congratulations on the intro let's hope uh the energy can remain up for the remainder of it's the episode from a kids party <laughs> cool all right can we point out i'm the chief uh, and i'm just Wait. a firefighter oh uh, um, i was gonna say what does that make sense with the baseball cap <laughs> incredible all right well <laughs> we will see you guys very shortly bye. bye i'm here with one ruby ennis hello how are you hello darling i'm good how about you i'm great it is so good yeah. to finally have you on the show thank you for agreeing oh, to join pleasure. you're very very welcome i was really excited um i you know I'm going to be honest, I didn't do anything crazy like Gus did. I didn't prepare, you know, prepare anything big. That being said, I, from experience, Gus is a, uh, doing a lot of visuals, but it's nothing really on the inside. So I'm excited to bring in the brains. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. I look, I, I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. Um, since it's, since it's your first time uh, on the show, uh, I've yeah. decided to stack your team with two mods of our community. Um, Thank you. I'm going to bring them in right now. Let's say hello to Syntax and Liz Dahlia. Hello to the both of you. Uh, welcome back to the show. Um, Thank you. Syntax, this is your Thanks. second time on the show. Uh, you were on yep. episode three of last year. Um, but for those mm -hmm. of the audience who don't know you, would you mind introducing yourself real quick? I'm Syntax Error. I mod things, break things, IT things, all different kinds of things. Probably see me around in the community. I don't know. What other things are there to describe me? Part of the Fortnite Friday crew, in and out of the Discord. Sometimes, occasionally, you'll see me on stream. Occasionally, you'll see me on uh, Halo updates all over the place <laughs> nice well you did um you wrote in your mm -hmm. application uh mm -hmm. your application was very uh short uh you just wrote in all caps um i don't know anything about video games in all caps 31 times um yeah so um I believe going I, strong. I feel I feel like I feel like that's a lie. I feel like you actually know things about video games. And although you proved me wrong last year, I think this year is gonna be your year. <laughs> it's gonna be this year. Well look, I have to say, I did go to EB Games. 
And I said to the guy, I said, hi, look, do you have a Nintendo Switch box that I could use as a prop to show that I know <laughs> nothing about any of this because uh, I don't. And, of course, they didn't have any boxes available for me. So you're just going to have to believe me on that yeah. prop. We're yeah. running off of pure natural talent only. <laughs> Yeah. Um, cool. Well, uh, Liz, welcome back. You were on episode one of last year. I brought you back for the finale of this year. Thank you for agreeing to be on the show. Uh, <laughs> do you want to tell those of the audience who don't know you a little bit about yourself? If you don't know me, then you probably had your head in the sand. I'm <laughs> here all the time. I'm one of the mods and I'm modded on the Discord. I also stream myself. I'm known as the Queen of Hearts. I'm an OG member of the Fortnite Friday crew with Syntax Now and Josh. We do that, obviously, every Friday, as the name sort of suggests. Um, but I also do other stuff at other times when I can be bothered. I'm on the Twitters. I'm on the TikToks. I'm doing all the things at all the places. Follow me at all the places, please. <laughs> Perfect. But, and yeah. yeah, we've got some uh, Nightbot uh, commands in chat to help us uh, get you to the socials of all of the lovely people who are on screen tonight. Um, but I want to talk about games. Ruby, uh, yeah. I asked what your gateway game was and you said in all caps, and with 18 exclamation marks, read a rabbit, baby! Yeah! And can I say, fucking me too. What a, yeah. what a cool game. Um, but as your top five games, you listed 10, which is perfectly normal. Um, you listed Undertale, Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door, Bioshock 2, Portal, Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, We Love Katamari, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, uh, Cult of the Lamb, Alice Madness Returns, and The Sims. That's a massive yeah. variety. Um, well, it was really tell us hard about to your gaming journey. Five. See, I play, I play a lot of games because I love to play video games. And the problem was, was just like five is too, like choosing a top five is really hard because like there's so many more games than just five. There's like mm -hmm. maybe like 10 or maybe like more than that. Yeah. So like I had to really think hard and I ended up choosing uh, 10. But I, my gaming journey, it's funny because Rita Rabbit, I would say, was my kind of sentient uh, a gateway game because the first game I ever ever played was uh, a, a Richard Scary game. Um, Is it was it just Grandma and Me? No, no, it was it was like Richard Scary's Town or something like that. Ah, oh, yeah, uh, yeah. But, but uh, like I played that as a kid and didn't even remember, and then I uh, remember playing. It was Busy Town. That's right. Thank you, Jake. Um, and. Yeah, then I, uh, the, uh, um, yeah, read a rabbit and I can read. So it looks like everyone on screen tonight can read, which is fantastic. Um, yeah, yeah. Syntax, uh, you listed yeah. as your top five games, Rocket League, Fortnite, God of War 2018, Portal 2 and The Stanley Parable, all on PC. That's right. um, are you a big PC gamer from way back? Was that, is that kind of your bread and Pretty butter? Pretty much. I only had a couple of games on my... I only had a couple of games on my PlayStation and I bought a second-hand Nintendo 64 just to play GoldenEye, Gus. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, no, I, I like to, to... I like a variety of different kinds of games even if I have a lower game completion for last year than you. <laughs> wow. But um, I like playing with lots of different kinds of topics. I think my of my top four, five last year and this year, I think only Rocket League has survived. I've, I kind of shifted around. Yeah, well, that's see. good. That's, that means you're trying yeah. new things. You're, you're, you're yeah. making, uh, making a whole new life of games for yourself. So that's awesome. That's exactly right. It's exactly right. Yeah. Uh, and Liz, you've listed as your top five games uh, Fable 2 as your number one. Oh, yeah. Fortnite, yeah. Gears of War, yeah. uh, Raft, mm -hmm. and Played Up. Um, tell us a yeah. little bit about okay. your gaming journey. Well, thank you because I couldn't remember what any of them were. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, it's not going to matter. I'm not going to get quiz on it. It'll be fine. Um, so each of the ones I sort of picked were kind of like representative of like particular sort of style of game so like fable 2 and oblivion and skyrim are all kind of very much the sort of same sort of vein but 
I kind of like Fable 2 the most because it's a little bit more like quirky. Um, and Fortnite because obviously Fortnite Friday, so I kind of have to have that on there. And if I don't, then I'll be like barred for life. And then um, Gears of War, which you, most people are probably surprised about, is because when I first started getting into gaming and I was watching Good Game and I was watching like, all of that sort of stuff, Hubby and I would play Gears of War together on the Xbox and that's kind of what, got me into playing games and so I have a very sort of nostalgic place for that in my heart now and then um played up is because of you know playing with friends and it's along the lines with like phasmophobia and among us and all that sort of stuff and the oh, yeah. chaos that comes along with playing with your cretins and <laughs> I can't remember what the other game was what is it uh you had raft <laughs> cozy oh, raft <laughs> Yeah, my simulation sort of building. I like to build stuff. I like to do the building and make everybody else get all the things. I micromanage everybody else. And that's the way that it should always be. <laughs> Amazing. Well, uh, we are, it's great to have you all uh, on team, repping Team Quantum tonight. I wish you all the Thanks. best of luck. Um, I'm going to bring everyone on screen right now. Here we go. <laughs> this is your cast for tonight. We've got Gus, Jep, and Middle C leading Team Inferno. And we've got Ruby, Syntax, and Liz doing Team Quantum stuff tonight. So, uh, it is an absolutely packed show. Uh, tonight we will be playing the best Pocket Pals games that we have. Are there any oh. uh, hopes, dreams, things that people would really love to see? Um, Name my cousin! Name my cousin! <laughs> I hope and dream I get games, it Liz? tomorrow. <laughs> I'd like to get a question. <laughs> uh, Liz, I need you to know that um, that is not... Oh. It's not my entire whole uh, deal. Uh, but I, I did prep a quick game of Name My no. Cousins! Yes. <laughs> the name of the game is Name My Cousins. The way you play the game is you name my cousins. Um, we are... I have 48 first cousins and descendants of my first cousins uh, born over the course of the last 50 years. I lived in rural Australia, so there's absolutely nothing better to do. Um, so, here's how this is going to work. Um, <laughs> Each of you are going to get five attempts to name one of my cousins. You'll get a point for each cousin that you correctly name. Gus, can you name one of my cousins? I've never actually watched this game played. I've only seen it. Um, uh, Sarah. I do not have a cousin <laughs> named Sarah. Ruby, name one of my cousins. Uh, Nick. I do not have a cousin named Nick. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeff, can you name one of my cousins? Um... Andrew. <laughs> Haven't got an Andrew. Sorry to sorry about that. Uh, Syntax, can you name one of my cousins? Did all your cousins Why die you in like a family reunion me? fire? And then um, there are Who could say? <laughs> Who could say? <laughs> oh, I'm so tempted do to it. continue the, do it for the context. Do it, do it, do it. You do realize if you say to. Steve right now, you're not getting a point. Just do <laughs> I'm too <laughs> competitive, Jake. <laughs> Uh, unfortunately, my brother's name is Jake, but Jake is not my cousin, as twisted as my family tree is. Uh, Middle C, can you name one of my cousins? Oh my god, I literally played this game last year and I can't remember his name. Um, <laughs> Peter. Uh, haven't got a Peter. Sorry. Liz, can you name one of my cousins? I can see name Steve. Steve. There's no Steve. Steve. Gus, can you name one of my cousins? Julie. No, Julie. I'll take, a, I'll take a Julia. Ruby. Juliet. Oh, God. Jack. I do yes! have a Jack. Jack, can you name one of my cousins? Sophie. No, Sophie. I'm sorry. Syntax. John. No, John. Middle C. Oh, what? <laughs> Emily. No, Emily. I'm sorry. Liz, can you name one of my cousins? Matt. There is a yes. Matt. Well yes. done. Gus, can you name one of my cousins? Gary. No, Gary. <laughs> sorry to hit. Sorry about it. Uh, Ruby. Tom. There is no Tom. I'm sorry. Jeb. Brandon. No, Brandon. Sorry. Syntax. <laughs> Luke. 
Haven't got a Luke. Um, middle C? Michael. No Michaels. Uh, Liz? Liam. I do have a Liam. Uh, Gus? <laughs> I did my homework. Uh, Chris or Christopher? I do have a Christram is his full oh, name, but I wouldn't baby. expect anyone to get that. <laughs> oh uh, Ruby, give me a name. Um, oh, I've run out. Um, Ben. I do have yes. a Ben. Uh, Jeff. Um, I can't think of any name. Uh, <laughs> what about Nikita? <laughs> No, Nikita. I'm sorry. Uh, syntax. Uh, Jessica? No, Jessica. Sorry. Middle C. Arnold. Haven't got an Arnold. I'm sorry. Uh, Liz. Michaela. There is a oh, Michaela. Uh, Gus. I've got so old-fashioned names and that's not going to work for this, is it? Um, Trevor. No, Trevor. I'm sorry. Ruby. Um, oh, uh... Without video games at all. Christy. I do not have a Christy. I'm sorry. Jeff. Um, Anthony. Nice guess. No Anthonys. Syntax. Mary? No, Mary. Although that was my grandmother's name. Uh, and she is oh, responsible yeah. for most of the squares. <laughs> um, She's someone <laughs> uh, Sarah. 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 I do not have a Sarah. I'm sorry. Liz. Josh. Joshua. There is a Joshua. Well done. Uh, Gus. Yes. Last round. Oh, shit. Uh, let's go... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do it. Angus. <laughs> nice, but unfortunately not. Uh, Ruby. Ruby. <laughs> there isn't a Ruby, I'm sorry. Uh, Jeff. Do it. Hmm. Do it. Uh, do Jerome. It. There, is, there is no Jerome. Syntax. <laughs> you didn't think this through. I've already given my name out. Um, <laughs> Paul. Uh, I haven't got a Paul, sorry. Middle C. I'm not gonna let syntax ruin our fun. Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> I have got a Chloe. <gasps> oh my god. It's Dahlia, last one. It's me, I'm the cousin. Lisa? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I have not got a Lisa. All right, well, that was fun. Uh, Tell me their names. <laughs> no, I can't. I could never. I could never. Um, but uh, cool. Well, let's get into our actual first game of the night. Uh, oh, wait, did that not count? No, that didn't count. But we're playing what? seven games tonight, and that was the first but one. we won. <laughs> oh, thank God. I'm it taking that as points. a win. It did get you points, uh, but uh, uh, no. Well, I mean, kind of. It doesn't count in the, oh, it counts in the <laughs> run time, I guess. We'll see. What we'll see. kind of game are you running? Uh, I, I don't know. All right, let's, let's get into our first actual proper game of the night. It was great. So there I am in my go-to double-lettered video game store taking photos of the games that I'm lobbying for my mum to get for my birthday. And then while I'm taking these photos, I hear a news story on the local television about the breakout of a highly dangerous criminal pocket. Out of nowhere, this pocket bursts through the window, starts flying around the store, pursued by what I now know to be the actual FBI. So I'm just here trying to take photos of video game boxes and this little shit of a thing keeps getting in the way, but I don't notice till I get home. So I bring all the photos home for my mum and she's like, I'm not buying you any of those games unless I know what's on the cover so I can make an informed decision about the purchases I'm making for my child. And I'm like, mum, I'm approaching 40. And she's like, tough tits, I'm not making the same mistake I did when I bought you BMX XXX for the PS2. And I'm like, I didn't even own a PS2. Anyway, I thought perhaps you guys could help me figure out what's underneath the pocket in each of these images. So essentially, I have a bunch of video game box arts. All you have to do is tell me what element Pockety is covering up in each image. Is that... Uh, clear, 
We good to go? Oh, yeah. Crystal. <laughs> <laughs> I, hope, so, I hope there is backstory and lore to every one of these games. <laughs> all involve your mother. Um, all right. Well, the way these games work is that once you buzz in, you can't buzz in again until one whole team is buzzed out. But other than that, I think that's the only other thing I needed to cover. Let's look, take a look at our first game. What do we think Poggerty is covering up in this copy of Bug Snacks for the PS5? Let me Buzz. unlock them for you. Buzz. Thank you. Uh, syntax, you got in first. Because we need to clear the buzz. <laughs> um, a strawberry. That is correct. There is Dude, a well strawberry. Done. Yeah. Uh, I just broke remember that. <laughs> All right. So proud. What do we think <laughs> is on top of this copy of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe? Ruby. Uh oh. Um. Uh, wait, uh, it's, um, it's, 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 uh, it's, uh, uh, is it Donkey Kong? Not Donkey Kong. Middle C? Ah, uh, beans. Is it Toad? Not Toad. Gus? Uh, it's Princess Peach. It is Princess Peach. I'm so sorry. Well done. So All right. Uh, let me reset those because I think everyone managed to get in there. Uh, what do we think uh, Pocket is covering up on this copy of Simpsons Hit and Run for the PS2? C. Uh, Chief Wiggum. Is it Wiggum? Not Chief Wiggum. Uh, Ruby. No, it's, it's, um, is it Lou? It's not. Uh, Liz? Marge? Marge it Simpsons? is Marge. She's covering up uh, Marge and Maggie there. All right. What do we think is um, Pocket is covering up on this copy of Bridge Constructor Portal? Gus? Uh, is it the, the the love cube? The heart, the heart love cube? I'll give that to you. Oh, it companion is cube. the companion, companion cube. cube. That's correct. <laughs> the love cube. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do we think Pocket is covering up on this copy of The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks? Uh, Ruby. Oh, I'm, I'm, uh, oh, okay. Zelda. It is Zelda. Uh, Can we not buzz in again? I'm buzzed still. I'm yeah, sure. no, so once everyone on one team is buzzed in, then you'll be able to come back okay. in. Okay. Yeah, sorry. So we, sorry for not making that no, uh, no, no, and so we're, we're, we're stuck until whoever hasn't buzzed on our team has buzzed in, potentially. Can that happen? That's mm. the thing. My cat just jumped on the desk. <laughs> until, until one whole team <laughs> is buzzed out, then I will reset everyone. <laughs> um, Cool. All right. What do we think is covering up this copy of Goldeneye? Um. Uh, oh. 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 Uh, you, you bought a Nintendo to play this in tax. Uh, to play it, not to look at the cover art. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, Jeff. Is it a Bond girl? Not a Bond girl. <laughs> All right. Real buzz? I'm going to free buzz. some people. <laughs> Gus. Is it Xenia on a top? Not Xenia on a top. Ruby? But it is like an Ivana Humpalot type figure, right? It is not. <laughs> Syntax. Is it a satellite? Closer, <laughs> but sadly not. All right, I'm gonna reveal it. This one was oh. covering up. Is it Sean Bean? It was it's just a helicopter. It was just covering up a helicopter. Helicopter. <laughs> helicopter. Uh, yeah, helicopter. Let me <clears throat> reset that and we'll Thank move you. on to the next one. What do we think Pocketty's covering up in this copy of Alice Madness Returns? Ruby. Uh, Cheshire Cat. It is covering up the Cheshire Cat. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah. Uh, what about this copy of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom? This one's quite small. But what's down there that Pocket is covering up? Uh, middle C. Is it Death Mountain? It is Death Mountain. Well done. I would have also accepted a volcano. Uh, what do we think Pocket is covering up the in this noobs. copy of uh, Mario Party, the original for the Where's N64? The... Uh, uh, Something that uh... Bowser's holding there. Uh, Gus. Is it a star? It is a star. Well done. All right. What about this? 
what's Pocketty covering up on this copy of Assassin's Creed 3? Uh, syntax. I had an idea and have immediately thought, no, I don't think that's the idea. Is it one of those, like, knife gauntlet glove thingies? <sighs> I've played Assassin's Creed, haven't I? Sadly not. Uh, Jeff? Is it a hatchet or small axe? It is, I'll give that to you. It's a tomahawk, but well done. That's correct. I was thinking a big purple dildo would have been really inappropriate. <laughs> it would have been great. <laughs> Whopping. It was Saints Row 3. Uh, all right, what about this copy of Dead Island 2? What do we reckon Pocket is covering up there? Uh, Liz. A zombie? Not a zombie. Uh, middle C. A beer. I'm Drink. gonna, Alcohol I'm gonna give it free. to you. I'm gonna give it to you. Yeah, uh, that that guy's holding a cocktail. Uh, well cocktail. done. Yep. He's almost so, gonna uh, say martini. All right. Uh, what about this copy of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate? What's Pockety covering up there? Uh, 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 Ruby. Uh, Kirby. It is Kirby. Well done. I know my boy. Yeah. I know my like, boy. There's a two-part game to this. It's, it's find the pockety and yeah. then what's it covering. It's like... <laughs> um, Love it. All right. What do we reckon pockety's covering up on this copy of Rayman Legends for the Wii U? Uh, Gus. That a big glow box. Glow, glow box. The, the blue guy. <sighs> Sadly not. The blue not. guy is actually pockety, Gus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nick put it on the um, Is that me? Sorry? Yep. Yeah. Um, is it like a, is it a teensy? Is that what they mm. call the little like blue creatures? Sadly not. Uh, that's one team buzzed out, so I'm going to reset if anyone wants to have another go. Uh, Gus. Is it a lum? The little <laughs> yellow... <laughs> what, what's left in that game? Ruby. <laughs> uh, rabid? <laughs> not a rabid. All right, I'm going to have to reveal this one. This one yeah. is the character Murphy, or he's like a frog. All right, what do we reckon's being covered up on this copy of Katamari Damasi? Uh, Ruby. The prince. Not the prince, sorry. What? Uh, Gus. Oh. The king? Sadly not. I know what it is. Ruby, Discord, Discord. You can private oh. chat your team. <laughs> yep, Liz. Just throw something in there. A cow? It is a cow. Oh, <laughs> I worked that out. Oh, team for the win. Oh a my bunch gosh. of dumbasses. <laughs> All right, last one. What do we think Pocket is covering up on this copy of Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare? Oh, oh. Gus. Is it a sunflower? It is a sunflower. Well done. Plants vs. Zombies 3 just dropped today on mobile as well. It sure Not did. Not sponsored, just saw it. And yeah. was like, I'm going to play that. Yeah. yeah. All right. With that, we are going to get straight into our next game. And it's another Pocket Pals Classic. Ah, oh. uh, next up. Uh, again. <laughs> no. <laughs> Imposters. <laughs> in Imposters, each player is going to take it in turns to play a famous oh, no. video game character or personality. Of course, there are some restrictions. You cannot say the name of the character or the games in which that character appears. And there is also a set of forbidden words which you are not allowed to say. This game is going to be played in teams. You'll have two minutes to describe your character to your teammates. So we're going to start with Gus and then Jeff and C will be interviewing Gus's character. No one else will be able to buzz in for two minutes. But once the timer runs out, you'll hear a buzz. It will be open to the other team. Um, if Team Inferno don't guess the character, obviously it will open up for, to Team Quantum for guessing as well. Then we'll swap teams and Ruby will do a character while Syntax and Liz guess. Does that make sense to everybody? Yeah. Cool. Everyone is going to play two characters. I am going to darken the screens of everyone and then I'm going to undarken Gus. Gus, can you see the screen right now? 
They can indeed. Thank Perfect. You. Uh, everyone will still be able to hear each other. They just won't be able to see the stream. So players, if you could minimize chat, please remember you are still on camera. We will get started. Gus, you are going to play this. Jep and Middle C, your time for interviewing Gus starts now. Good evening. Well, thanks so much for coming to the interview today. Um, the panel uh, really wants to thank you for your time preparing your application. Uh, would you say you identify as a man or a woman or uh, any other gender? I'm a man and my God, what a man I am. Okay. Hmm. Just hearing your voice that way and not being able to see anything is, is strange. Um, uh, what do, and we, what do you... Yeah. What was that? Would you say you're known for having a certain type of voice? I have a cool, calm voice that stays calm under pressure, especially mm. when there's explosions, things like bullets, reading. Okay. Are you a secret agent? Some would say yes. I would prefer if this red from a box would be shaky. I mean, come on, we're all there. Let's do it. It's what he often says. <laughs> uh, you don't have to buzz in in this one, middle seat. You can oh, just okay. guess. But it's so fun. Um, James Bond. <laughs> I would love to keep playing him for another minute, but yes. <laughs> so That's sorry. correct. Though. Gus was playing James yes. Bond from GoldenEye. Oh, I love well that done. you picked Pierce Brosnan. That's... That's class. Yeah, this is the, this is <laughs> no, the golden eye bond. This is the golden eye. Uh, yeah. All right, Ruby, you're going to go next. Hi. I'm going to blind everyone and then unblind you. Ruby, can you see the screen? Yes. Perfect. You are going to be playing this. Uh, <laughs> Syntax and Liz. Just familiar, you, f familiarize yourself with the forbidden words. Syntax and Liz, your time to interview Ruby starts now. All right. Male, Thank female, you for doing other? This. Other. Okay. Okay. Um, are you animate? Like a person or a character that can walk around? Creature. Huh? Creature. Okay. Uh, is are you something that we've seen on Back Pocket? Yeah. Okay. Um. Are you a recent thing or an old thing? Mm, I'm very, very new. Very, very new. Very really okay. new. Oh my god. Yeah, I come in, in many forms. Okay. Have we had your creator on the show? Yeah. Okay, so that narrows it down quite a bit. Quite. Uh, um, oh! What's the thing with the words? <laughs> yeah. The thing with the words? The, 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 the game with oh, the, the, the words. Uh, what is uh -huh. it called? Gumpkin things? Because <laughs> um. <laughs> it's the way that you get. Yeah. Like, yeah. It's, it's, and you can make all the things like sexy and stuff. So, is it. What, what, what's it called? What? Giggy. <laughs> I don't remember yeah. what it's called. It's like Gubbins. Like something. Gubbins! Gubbins! Yes! Gubbins! <laughs> oh. yeah. I could have sworn, sworn it was me as a Pikmin, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good question, Liz. Nick, you're muted. Wait. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Let's head back to Inferno. <laughs> uh, I'm going to... Jep, you're going to be up. I'm going to blind everyone. And then I'm going to unblind oh. Jep. Jep, can you see the screen? Yes. Cool. You are going to be playing this. Uh, and Gus okay. and Middle C, your time for interviewing Jep starts now. G'day, mate. How are you? Hello? <laughs> what was that? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Okay. Uh, let me see. You want to take the potato uh, board on this one? <laughs> what, what do you spend most of your time doing? Um, uh, sorry, I'm just checking a list real quick. Um, that's fair enough. Running, mm -hmm. jumping, mm -hmm. <laughs> dashing. Mm -hmm. Are you, you identified as male, female, non binary? Um, I'm a creature. You're a creature. Okay. Uh, are you from a fantasy world? Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
are you the protagonist of said world? I am. Interesting. Uh, middle C? Huh? Uh, I, the protagonist, uh, do you rescue people? Do you save lands? Why are you the protagonist? Um, I restore. Um. <laughs> restore. Is your high voice a defining factor of your character? It's. I actually don't know. I, you don't know. You're just winging it. You're just thinking. Do you have a voice in the game you exist in? I don't think so. It's okay, just so the happen. voice is just a fucking red herring here. Okay. Uh, sure. Are you in a Nintendo game? I'm not. I'm not. Are you in a uh, a current game that's been out in the last twelve months? Um, it's a couple years old. I think okay. there are two games. There were two. Um, oh Fifteen god. seconds. Uh, what? Oh god. Uh, <laughs> uh, I was gonna say Toad, but if you're not the protagonist, <laughs> I mean. Fuck it. Are you Toad? Are you Toad? No. Um. I mean. <laughs> and, and what? Uh, okay, it is open for Quantum to buzz in if you think you know. Oh, no. Good luck to you as well. Don't say that. <laughs> um, oh, God. Um, feel free to uh... keep interviewing. You can narrow it down, I'm sure. So, pick up a lot of abilities. Don't give them tips. Are Let you... them ask you stuff. Are you, are you an animal? It's all right. Are you Hollow Knight? I'm not Hollow Knight. <laughs> I don't know how Hollow Knight would sound. Do you li- do you live in a colourful world or a kind of dark world? Um, it's <laughs> I, I kind of make it more colourful as I go. Oh, uh, Ruby. Yeah. I don't know why I need to say my name. You didn't, um, but that's cool. Uh, <laughs> are you? Oh, no, I feel like this is too. <laughs> are you chicory? No, I'm not. Oh man. Okay. Good guess, but. Yeah. Oh man. Uh, yeah, syntax. I, no <laughs> I just got to throw one out in the wild here. Uh, you're not. I don't know the protagonist's name, but from Cuphead, the main guy from Cuphead. <laughs> Unfortunately not. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna. I'm gonna reveal this. Uh, Is Jeff giggling in the voice? Like, <laughs> yes. <laughs> that's really me off. Uh, Jeff oh! was oh! oh! Good, good. You had everything there. That was a tough one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was that was tough. That was tough. All right. Uh, I love that. That's a beautiful game with like an orchestral uh, and painterly world, and then the character goes to speak, and it's like, "Get a, I'm gonna bounce around and stuff." And you're like, "Oh my god, maybe we just make it a silent protagonist." <laughs> All right, uh, syntax, you're up. Syntax, can you okay. see the screen right now? Yeah. Cool. You are going to be playing this. Um, <laughs> uh, Ruby and Liz, your time to interview Syntax starts now. Are you uh, real or a character? Um, in some ways, neither. Okay. I know that was mm, okay. Some so of our nerds out there think I'm a character. You're, are you a person or are you an object? I am an object. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, is, are you something that you'd find around the house? Uh, no. no. Well, yes. Yes, yes. actually. Um, not this particular one. Okay. So we'd, so we'd find Whoa. something like you around a home? Uh, yes. Many kids would play with me around the home. Is there something... From- Fortnite? Not Fortnite. Are you are you uh, uh the are you the main character in your video game? Um I am the main thing in my video game. The main thing in your video game. Um is it are you something that the the uh that can be controlled in the game? Uh no, something you can control can interact with me. <laughs> Okay. Oh, 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 um, does the protagonist love you? Um, no. Oh, I know what you're good. thinking. Close. Yeah. Similar colouring. Uh, different shape. Oh, beans. Uh, oh, uh, oh. Can you give us some blue syntax? Um, okay. 
it's very difficult because there's one thing here that would give it away instantly. Um, right. Personally, I love it. <gasps> okay. It's something from Rocket League. Oh, it's a Rocket yeah. League thing. So if it's you were, open you for everyone to buzz, uh, Gus. <laughs> Are you the, the ball the in ball? Rocket League? Yeah. Yes. Well done. Wait, I said it. <laughs> Ruby said that. I said you were soccer ball. Really? Out of time and then got buzzed. I got buzzed out? Are you yeah. kidding? Chat. The, ti the time round, I, wait I, waited, I waited for buzz and then I put my buzz in. Uh, have chat says Gus said first, so oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna lovely. have to give that one to Gus. I'm that's, sorry. That's alright. Um, no problem, guys. Yeah, the other Rocket League. Yes, yeah. it was yeah. the ball <laughs> from Rocket League. No problem. Um, oh, that's so good. <laughs> all right. Uh, I realised I had to pivot quick. <laughs> uh, you're up. I'm yeah, going to. If the ball had a voice. What voice would it? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> uh, middle seat. Can you see the screen right now? I can't. Perfect. You are going to be playing this. Uh, and Gus So and, excited. Uh, yeah. Gus and Jep, <laughs> uh, your time to interview Middle C starts now. Hi, Middle C, or the character you're playing. Are you male? Welcome. Or Thank you what so much for joining us tonight. We got some great stuff for you here tonight. Okay, I'm thrown. Uh, are you male, female, or non-binary? I'm all man, baby. Okay, Jeff, take it away. Okay. Um, what do you What do you do most days? <laughs> I bring the people what they want. Okay. I'm here to show the world the greatness of an evolving new medium. Are you a character in a game? Yes. Weirdly. <laughs> Interesting. You sound like, yeah, you're here to show off something. You, you, Are you... You're, quite, you're quite an ego. If I'd met me, I could say that potentially, yes, I have an ego. Okay, Jeff? Um, are you the main character in your game? I am the main character of the thing that I create. Mm. But I okay, would say I, I am. I have appeared in games. I am oh. not a, a character. Are you also the game? Uh, one of the game's developers? No, but I know a lot of game developers. Like a lot of them. Like so many of them. Some of them are my best friends. I even appear on podcasts for some of them. Sometimes they let me. If they're not too busy <laughs> hanging out with their director friends. Their horror movie director friends. Their horror, horror movie. movie yeah, it's me. Kojima or Jason. Oh. That name you just said. That's the person I want to be best friends with. I want to be friends with Kojima, which means that you are. Uh, ah. Uh, Ten seconds. I let him show off my. I let Summer, him show Summer off. Games Fest. Are you? Are you uh, hosting oh, Summer Games Fest? Jeff Keighley. Are you Jeff Keighley? <laughs> 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 well done. That was right on the buzzer. Congratulations. Nice. Cool. Yeah. All right. Uh, There's so many banned words. Yeah. <laughs> when it started, I was like, oh my God, is it buzz from the buzz trivia game? <laughs> <laughs> nice, nice. Man, that was that was very, very close. All right, Liz, you're up. You, um, let me just unblind you so you can see. Can you see the screen? Yes. Perfect. All right, you are going to be playing this. Uh, please oh take a moment to just uh, familiarize okay. yourself with all of the words. And uh, Ruby and Syntax, your time to interview Liz's character starts now. Are you a real person or a video game character? Huh? What? Huh? <laughs> Huh? Okay, are you a creature? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are you are you like an animal or are you an object? Mm hmm Okay. Animal. Animal? Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you from anything Nintendo related? Uh-uh. Although technically this thing is everywhere, so probably maybe. <laughs> You hear um, these sounds from afar. Oh, I need that. And you 
Do you, Syntax, are, are you an animal you would, that flies? You would go running for this. If you, if you would go running for this. That's if you good. hear it, you go running for it. I heard it. You got like one go minute? Like syntax it. specifically? So, yeah, syntax night, specifically. Presumably. Yeah, there we go. Um, So you're an animal in Fortnite? Yes. Oh! Wait, animal? Yep, yes. Are you, are you a llama? Yes. It specifically has, there's a first word to oh, there. The Fortnite llama. Which I'll give that to you. Word. I'll give that to you. Um, oh it oh, was the, the loot llama from Fortnite. <laughs> well done. Llama sound for Christ's sake. And Liz, one more time with the sound, just so we can all get that in context. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are going to head back up in reverse order. So C's going to go next, then Liz, then Jeff, then Syntax, then Gus, and finally Ruby. So, uh, middle C, you, my friend, are going to be playing... Can you see the screen to start with? <laughs> I can see the screen. Perfect. You are going to be playing this. Take a moment to familiarize yourself. Gus and Jep, your time for interviewing Middle C starts now. Middle C, do you want to start with a, a spiel like you did last time or want us to hit you with questions? <laughs> oh God, okay, questions. Um, are, you, are you an animal or a human? Uh, I'm just looking at my words. That's all right, <laughs> time. I am a not not an animal or a human, but I am alive. Shit. Um, <laughs> are you male, human. female, or non-binary? I'm gonna say non-binary. Shit. Uh, <laughs> Jeff. Um, are you like an artificial intelligence or something? Are you a construct? No, no. I, I am very much alive. All right, give us give us a spiel. Give us your best impersonation of this thing. Um, I don't have any maracas on me, so I can't do anything. But uh, I. Shit! What is this? Maracas. Um, okay. One minute. Uh, that's a hint. <laughs> um, you don't have any maracas on you. Uh, you're not male, female. Or... You're Are you? Uh, in uh, viral, I... which isn't a banned word. Fuck. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, are you, uh... And you will you... find me. So many of me. I'm hidden everywhere. Okay, oh, are you an enemy? This game. Are you an enemy? No, in... I'm I'm a friend. You, you're an ally, you're a friend. I you give make... you things. Oh, 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 seconds. hello. You're, you're a Korok. You're a little Korok. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I yes, thought about C keeping was up a with the, like, giggling. Really, 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 like, very Korok, Korok, Korok. The first, you're the first, that first like, noise? Hi. Did you make it a... <laughs> it like, no, no, the first noise was perfect. Like, the... the uh -huh. It was perfect. Yeah, yeah. No, and I was very... It wasn't I was, ya -ha -ha. If you ya ha ha I would have been very, very upset. <laughs> she started and went... <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, up next is Liz Dahlia. Liz, you... Can you see the screen? Yes. Perfect. You are going to be playing this. Take a moment. Okay to familiarize yourself. Ruby and Syntax, your time to interview Liz starts now. Are you a creature or a person or an object? A humanoid, okay. but can turn, have the thing come out when I do damage to my Fellow, making sure it's not a what? Uh, people that I live with on the place that I'm at. Huh? I, okay. I, 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 I do the damage. I do, I do the damage to the other people, mm -hmm. and I'm pretending that I don't, and I'm meant to be doing things, but instead I do damage. Are you at all, Rob? The Transformers universe already? No. No. There's usually a, a big group of us. And we are all doing things. And are you controlled by someone you, else? Sometimes sometimes I have help. It's depending on how many in the group, I may have help. If there's a big group, I might have help and we all and we both do the damage. And we try to pretend that we're not doing the damage. 
but you know sometimes people oh can... oh are you from among us yes are you I'm a very the specific dust... color oh the, are you the, the red one red. no i i am all about our team right now I'm oh you're so the green one green. You're yeah. the green, among us. green among us yep very good cute crewmate the green among crewmate us. from among us well done okay. oh. all right that's good I no, no I just I just wanted to it's just a specific <laughs> one. Um cool. All right. Uh up next is gonna be Jeff. Thank god I could say damage. Jeff, you can you see the screen? Yep. Cool. You are going to be playing this. I'm so sorry. Okay. Uh <laughs> and uh Middle C and Gus, your time to interview Jeff starts now. I think you're muted. You know, let's see. Are you, are you <laughs> man, woman, non-binary? I'm non... Uh... Oh, okay. We I'm not alive. alive. I'm not a living... Excellent. Okay. Are you a playable character from a video game? I'm used by a playable character. Are you an item from a video game? Yes. Okay. What type of video game? Um, uh... You have the genre? One of my top five. One of your top five? Jeez, I forgot, mate. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. Uh, are you from a, are you from um, a shooter? I would say, I'll say, um, Black Mesa. Okay, so you're oh, an okay. item. Are you, are you... Are you a metallic item? I am. You're the crowbar. I am. Yes! <laughs> well done. Well done. <laughs> well done. Oh. Well done. Good, nice. good oh. catch. All right. Uh, we have got three more to go. Syntax, you are yeah. up. You, okay. my friend, are going to be playing mm -hmm. this. And <laughs> Ruby and Liz, your time to interview Syntax starts now. Human, creature, or object? Object. Okay. Okay. Um, sorry. Um, <laughs> I, my, my ears were burning earlier, Ruby, when you seemed to allude to me. Uh, just before? Yeah, when I heard you make a guess that sounded like me. Oh, oh, uh, I forget everything <laughs> I say the second I say it. <laughs> fair enough, fair oh enough. We can move on. Is, is it a game that you like? Uh, that you specifically yes. syntax like? Okay. Yes. So, this is a game uh, where uh, I am very useful to you, right. but also can be the center of your life. Oh, okay. Oh, do, uh, are you something that I love? Perhaps, yeah. Uh, are you, are you potentially cube like in shape oh, oh you make me blush <laughs> uh, 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 do i have to kill you you don't not to, <laughs> not always but are you yes, the companion you cube yes. oh, well yes. done oh. that's my babe that's my baby <laughs> oh. all right uh we have got two more to go gus you're up gus you are going to be playing this and Jep and Middle C, your time to interview Gus starts now. Hi guys. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh. Hello. Um, Wait, are you talking? Uh, no. Are you, you you're, as a pick? <laughs> you're pick. <laughs> no. Okay. No, but I'm Gus related. Um, that's fine. I'm um, creative, and I wear many, many faces. Ask me some of those questions from before. <laughs> before? Oh, uh, we've all I've been asking. Come on. What type of what type of game are you in? I'm not in a game. Not in. Nah. Oh, so you're a real person? Oh no. <laughs> oh, you're pockety. <laughs> How'd you do that? I mean, how'd you do that? 
That was incredible. incredible. Faces <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I drew this. I have hundreds of them. I can't believe I didn't think to uh, do Gus as one of the band words, but uh, yeah. there you go. <laughs> I was channeling Pete when he had to do the voice of Pockety once. Yeah, yeah that's right. So, yep. yeah, apologies. Pete, <laughs> Pete for that. All right, uh, Ruby. Uh, yeah. You are doing our last one. Uh, okay. You are going to be playing this and um, Syntax and Liz. Uh, I'll be honest, I don't expect you to get it. But, oh my God. <laughs> but your time to interview Ruby starts now. Okay, so it's the last one, so it's probably going to be something weird. Yep. Um, um, male, female, non binary. Female, very. Very. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, in a video thing? game or IRL? I'm as real as they get, but I'm right, telling okay. a lie in a way. Fair enough. Um, Is uh, it? Are you are you associated with the show Back Pocket? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like, is is there something to do with you, Ruby? <laughs> well, yeah. Okay. <laughs> is it you holding the gun? Um. Partially. Uh, okay. Imagine, imagine if I was trying to sneak into a movie, but I was underage. <laughs> so something to do with like a trench coat, mm -hmm. right? And is you're there with a gun in a trench coat? The gun's unimportant. Okay, right. Okay. So it's you in a trench coat. Uh huh. Is there other things with you? Uh, potentially. Right. Think of multiplying. Okay. Calculators or anything? No, no. Okay. Is there, other is, there, is there you and somebody else? No. Or multiple of you? Yeah. Right. Okay. okay. So is it times two? Uh-uh. Times three? Uh-huh. Okay. So it's you times three in a, in a trench coat. Are we going to take that? I am going to take that. Well oh! done. <laughs> It was three rubies in a trench coat, and oh, you God. fucking got it. Unbelievable. <laughs> I'm oh, seeing an R-rated movie. Connected. <laughs> that was incredible. All right. Uh, just before we head to the break, I think it's time we check the scores. So, Team Inferno, you guys are currently sitting on 14 points. Team Quantum... You are currently sitting on 17 oh. points. Rigged. We are going to take our first break of the night and then when we come back, more games. Australians, save you now, and on heart, the Marmite sucks, and I will lose one of the characters in this Telltale game in honour of Vegemite being the superior brown yeast product. Vegemite, I love you. Dreadful visions haunt me as I gaze upon the sea. And oh, what furtive bounty in deep, dark possibility. All aboard for strange horizons, yond the sight of those ashore. Seamen hauled a feeble cargo to a place to find no more. Bound so tight, dead hands numb and white, a heavy implication. In dusky light and out of sight, now, food for some crustacean. For a mighty shell, red as hell, it breached through waves almighty, and from its moor an ancient roar, then bloodshed quite unsightly. What better nest to lay to rest than out past Circular Quay? 
So leave the heads and drop your dead to the heart of Middle Sea. Middle Sea colossal crab fingers for a Leviathan appetite. Every ninja knows that after a hard day at the dojo, there's only one place that can satisfy your hunger, and that's Ninja Pyru Native Barbecue. Nestled deep in the heart of the bustling Kakadu National Park, you might not see our signs, but you can smell us from a mile away. Enjoy our signature flame grilled kangaroo burger. It may look like two juicy roux patties with onion, tomato, pickles, and a dash of Pyru barbecue sauce on a toasted bun, but don't let your eyes fool you, this burger is 100% kangaroo. Check out our extensive menu of delicious native delicacies. Smile and throw back some of our plumptious balls of popcorn quokka. Introducing our saltwater crocodile croquettes. Take the bite back to those ancient monsters. And back for a limited time from across the Tasman, try our exceptionally rare strips of stripy steak. Get it now before it vanishes for good. Our venue is now equipped with multiple function rooms, perfect for toddler birthday parties or CEO karaoke. So come on down to Ninja Pyro Native Barbecue today. Ninja Pyro Native Barbecue. From our backyard to your plate. But I didn't hire the deputy. Castle's just screaming in the chat right now. That's not the words, Joshua! <laughs> the words for what? Have you checked in your butthole? Dee doo dee doo butthole. No. And I don't want to. <laughs> Where is everyone? Where is everyone? There they are. There they are. Let's land on the floor. Let's land on the floor. I'm gonna shoot someone in the head. Gonna shoot someone in the head. Well, I still don't have a gun. I only Liz have a still thermal. doesn't have a gun. She's getting shot at. She's being shot at by others, you see, but Liz doesn't have a gun. Don't know the rest of the words to the song. <laughs> Welcome back. You saw their words from Dolphin Pants, Multifish, and Muso for Hire with all of the Fortnite Friday crew, as well as the Middle Sea and Ninja Pyro ads. Um, we are going to jump straight into our next segment. In this game, I'm going to ask each team to pick a decade of gaming from either the 90s, the 2000s, the 2010s, or the 2020s. Then, I'll show that team a randomised set of 10 games that were released in that decade, one at a time, and as each game is shown, they need to put the game in chronological order on a timeline. The games will be completely shuffled in time each time, even I don't know what order they're going to come out in. Placing a game in the correct position will give that team a point. 
Once there's more than five games on the timeline, you'll get two points for a correct placement and one point if you're close. Once each decade's done, we'll swap teams. Team Inferno, we're going to start with you. Between all of you, what would you say is... I guess pick a decade. What would you say is your highest yeah. level of combined proficiency? Before we roll in, why is every intro card like a Netflix murder mystery every time it starts? <laughs> I was like, who's the killer? Uh, <laughs> wonderful work, as usual. Uh, I'm going to start the conversation and say, I feel like recency bias could help us here. And I think in terms of dates, 2020s make sense because at least we'll have a touchstone there. But I'm open to the team. What do we think? I was thinking the same, Gus, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah, yep. I'm happy to do that. Let's do a 2020s. All right, let's start with the 2020s. So first we've got Deathloop placed on September 14th, 2021. Last of Us Part 2. Did that come before or after Deathloop? I see how this works now and I regret so it's my either decision. here or um, here. Yeah, okay, no. okay. Right. Does anyone know definitely? Because I, I, I think don't. it was before. I think it was before. I was thinking before as well, but I... I'm not certain. <laughs> we played it for a pocket uh, game club, and then we talked about The Last of Us, and I'm going to say I think it's after. I We did a Last of Us retrospective, and then I played all of Deathloop, and I'm certain I did all of that after that retrospective. So I'm, I'm going to veto the team just the once, and I'm going to say it's after. So you're saying The Last of Us comes after Death. I'm happy Deathloop. to go with that. I'm happy to go. No, the other way around. Oh. So The Last of Us is the one in question. Oh. So That's what we were saying. <laughs> oh, great. Well, I, I take back my veto and <laughs> Team Inferno charges ahead. All right. You're not well, right. I'm right. So you planted discontent in your team for no reason. Right, yes. well, <laughs> they knew what they were getting on board and then I was the team captain. All right. Turns out all of you are correct because The Last of Us was released in 2020. What about It Takes Two? Where does that fit relative to these three? It Takes Two won Game of the Year in... Mm -hmm. Not last year, which was 2023. The my my gut says it sits smack back. It sits in the middle. That's my first reaction. Yeah. Uh, again, Last of Us Part Two. It's quite a while back now. Deathloop was strange. Yeah. That's, I think you're that's, right. That's, I think you're yeah, right, Gus. Yeah. yeah. That's 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 that's. Jeff it was one of the Vito. first game club. It was one of the first yes, games. Okay. Yes. 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 Good. Which was 2021? Sure. <laughs> All right, you're yep. saying that? Yep. yep. Cool. Yep. You are correct. What about nice. Prince nice. of Persia, The Lost Crown? That's now. That's just now. I just, I just finished it last night. It's now. It's at the end. It's at the end? It's, the end. it's where it is. Yeah, oh, sure is at the end because it came out today. <laughs> yeah. What about Metroid Dread? Where do we think that one lives? Both in between, fucking games. In between uh, Deathloop and... Prince of Persia, it was last year, right? Go yeah. for it. Yep, I trust you on that. You yep. are yeah. correct. What about Stray? So from here on out, you've got five games placed. From here on out, if you get it bang on, you'll be you'll get two points. If you're one off, you'll get one point. I would have thought that between Metroid and Prince of Persia, um, that's where mm. I would think, but I'm... Uh, oh, God. Maybe... No, I think... What's it on... I... Um... Oh, sorry. You good? Oh, no. No, no, both you guys, both guys. Jeff, what do you um, Was it on... It wasn't like a PS5 launch title, right? I don't know why I'm thinking that. It wasn't a launch was, title. Was it before PS5 came out? I, 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 I think that's where it sits. I, I don't have dates or anything in my head. This is all just gut feeling, but it's like... It's the, I, it's the biggest range as well, so it's the safest guess anyway. Tenth, that's a good point. Look at that, you got 2021 and 2024. <laughs> Versus we're trying to what squeeze it between those two. No, I think I think you're right. Actually, I was getting my ideas wrong. I think you're right. You sure? We can we can move it. What do you reckon? Nah. All right, let's leave it there for now. Neil. All right, that is <laughs> correct. For two points, bang in the right spot. Where does the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom fit in this timeline now? Pop it over. Just pop it over one, mate. Just pop it over there. Just there. Yeah, there you go. Lock it in, Eddie. Thank you. All right. Oh, that guys, is for two melt. points. We did good to pick this. What about Gubbins? Uh, oh. Pop it over. Just one over. That's over. Oh, that's oh wait. Oh, me, I hit my right? mic. Uh, early release? What are we talking? Oh, is this uh, early access? <laughs> full release? This is 
first initial release in Australia. There was early access. What? <laughs> um, <laughs> um, I'm still thinking uh, here, but I feel like so I heard that, about it. So that would include later. Yeah, if that was early, uh, early access, it could trump Zelda. Um, that's that's the curveball. It could sit there. It could sit. Twenty. I'm, I'm Ruby is so tiny down in the little box down there, but I'm just looking. I can see her <laughs> smiling and making all <laughs> sorts of faces. So this would include early access. So you're allowed to answer us that name. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's definitely not between Prince of Persia and Zelda. It might be one back. It could even be another one back from that. What do we think, guys? It could be there. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I... But I don't know. I just know it came out recently. <laughs> I, I was I was picturing between Zelda and Prince of Persia. So it, I'm yeah, just going to yeah, say yeah, that. I'm going to on the this. early access date. So maybe that's, that's a full release, but early access definitely beats Zelda. Yeah, so we'll okay. Over, and... I reckon... If we're one across from it, we get one point. So maybe if you yep. put it in Stray, right. between Stray and Zelda, then yeah, it's... and that's also again the range is long. That's nearly a year between them. So uh, I'm trying to poke in Nick's face, but it's not working. Um, <laughs> okay, blackjack. Ah, uh, fuck. Back I, I, us. <laughs> I'm I'm happy with this. I think. Yeah. Sure, look, it is. Yeah, if you guys are. Yeah, let's bit. do it. Let's do it. All right. Okay. I will tell you that is in exactly the correct position for two points. Nice. It uh, was initially released on iOS on in March. Uh, bug That's snacks. Where do we done. reckon that one fits? Um, that had oh, early uh, access as well, right? Did too. And that could have had something as like I'm gonna go crazy here and say it's between Last of Us and Nintendo. We are whatever we eat. <laughs> I'm gonna say that's <laughs> delightful, but it's not helpful. Um, <laughs> like early, early access. I, I feel like it's it's definitely this end of the spectrum. It could be. Does anyone know? Does anyone have any more? In, you were singing the song, but we'll see. What do you got? Uh, it's about as far as I got with both. That's all you have. I think it. I think it is. Um, it's PS5. It was came out on PS5. Um. It, uh, I, like I remember hearing about it before it takes two. Yeah, I feel like I, I feel like that I feels I, like I have the a right worry. spot for it. I think that's where we should start. I, I, my curveball is that it could be precedes this. It could be something that's been talked about and floated for like a while before. Like, I remember it being one of those things that everyone had like there was this weird early accesses that people had seen and like this game's coming out. I, I yeah, early access. That's right. No, I'm thinking of Ooblets. <laughs> that's game. a sentence that makes nice. sense on a Don't video you game. Don't hate it when you confuse go. your bug snacks with your ooblets. I, um, I would say it's there, but I have a little feeling it could be left of Last of Us. But I feel like the safe thing okay. would be to plop it there because then we get, then we get both sides potentially. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you're saying between the Last of Us and It Takes Two is where Bug Snacks lives. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, that is correct. <laughs> You've Holy so shit, far guys, had a perfect round. Obviously, the last one is probably <laughs> the hardest. Where do you think immortality lives? My gut was to go between Gubbins and Zelda. That's where I would start. Um, but I never played this. I know we talked about it before. The it was end last the... year, wasn't it? Oh yeah, no! People played it before play it. the end of. Was... They played it before the end of twenty. The end of twenty twenty two. So if you knocked it back another one before Gubbins, please, Nick. Yeah, I think before yeah. Gubbins, after Stray. Yeah. Yeah, people talked about it at the end of twenty twenty two. It came out and people said, "I'm going to play Immortality over the break." Between that, that that is my vote. Please, someone get in there. And no, no, I agree I because I feel like it, it was the game of the year conversation for the end of twenty two. It wasn't in the right. conversation I last year. Right. I'll do yeah. it once if we oh. get this right. I and I'm Jeff right. Keighley. And you're Jeff Keighley, okay. so are you we, fucking know. Are we saying immo immortality sits between Stray and Gubbins? Correct. All right. Yeah. That yeah. is, for the first time in the history of this game, a perfect oh. round. Incredible. You got Incredible. every point it was possible yes. to get gentlemen, in that game. Gentlemen. Oh, snap your overalls, everyone. It's a freaking ah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. Good luck. Good luck, other team. Quantum, Man. you guys are up. Your Have cigarette. you chosen a decade? Oh. I'm going to need a fucking cigarette after that. <laughs> um, 
It was the, not even for the future, not the past. Uh, exactly. Uh, we're gonna go for a bit later recency bias, and we're yeah. gonna go with the 2010s. <laughs> 2010s. All right. Yeah. So we've got Very Minecraft cool. set at November the 25th, 2010. That one's fixed. I want you to tell me was Super Mario Odyssey before or after that? Definitely after. It after was that. Super Mario so Odyssey after. was like 2017, 2018. right? 2017. 20, it was either 17 or 18 because it was around I, I the release of the Switch. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right. I'm going to take your word for it. It's yep. correct. What about Mass Effect Yay. 2? Oh, I mean, it's obviously... Oh, no. In Wait. between? What do you think? Everyone... I'm everyone... running your coattails. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how unfortunate. Yeah. <laughs> they are burnt. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to remember. Mass Effect 1, I think, was 2009. Yeah, because like I, I, everyone pins me as a Mass Effect girly, and I've never played a single one. Uh, so my mind is kind of going purely off my uh, like EB Games knowledge. Um, yeah, I'm gonna. I think I think it's in between. My think it'd be, is so yeah. old. It's it is. Yeah, like honestly, my thought would be oh. either like if we got really unlucky to be before Minecraft, but I yeah. don't think i feel like it's gonna be just up yeah okay. I, let, let's keep it there let's seek together all right <laughs> unfortunately that one lived thing. before oh, minecraft God. <laughs> okay it's fine the original release of the it's last fine. of us <gasps> it came out yeah <laughs> step like that one so true it did come out <laughs> Um, the answer is it came out. Yeah. <laughs> and um, it locked that in. Right. <laughs> Lock it in. And we're done. Okay. I'm gonna say 2015, 16, somewhere in that area. So there, so there somewhere. That would be my guess. Team, what do yeah. we feel? No, I, I agree. I, I have agree. a vague recollection of Steph streaming this and having to mod those streams. And now I'm trying to remember how long ago that possibly was. Just so... be careful you're not thinking of Last of Us Part 2 or like a reboot. No, I have a vague recollection of that one. And they do use the word vague. Uh, I think it's there. I, I think it stays there where it is. Okay. Okay. You are correct. It came oh, out in God. 2013. Oh, <laughs> Grand Theft Auto oh, no. 5. <laughs> Okay, wait, I worked at even kiss when this came out. Hold on. Hold the phone. Uh. I've seen like 50 bajillion memes and I don't remember the sequel date. I think. Mm -hmm. Um, oh, uh, I think it was after Last of Us and before Odyssey. So I'm there? pretty yeah. sure because. So, yeah. Because I remember someone saying that 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 it's like, oh, I've lost everyone. Yeah, but it's not ten. Oh. So I definitely remember uh, playing it in 2014. Yeah. Right. So wait, and sorry, wrong. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Rewrite. 2015, I definitely remember playing it. No, yeah, because you know what? I started working at EB Games in 2013. Um, and I'm pretty sure it came out like a little bit after that. So I think I think it's supposed to be there. All right. Okay. I'm happy to see I'll agree. You. <laughs> Good thing you did because that is correct. Oh, thank God. Oh, oh. So from here on out, oh, we've got five shit. placed. Every one placed in the exact correct position will get you two points, and you'll be you'll get one point for being one off. What do we think about The Witcher Three Wild Hunt? Um, I thought it was a really good game. Yeah. Wasn't that one an exclusive for? I, th I want to say that was a later one. I I remember I... buying that for, for hubby. I think it was before Grand Theft Auto 5. 
Oh. Uh. Me when I lie. Oh. I go. Oh, I don't know. Oh my god. So you're saying there? No. I think it's too tight of a gap between June and September. Yeah, I think I think it's after. I, yeah, I would say after. after. Are you feeling that? Yeah, I don't think it's as as, as l l past 2017. No, like past yeah. where the switches come out. That's so, a big gap, and I feel like uh, Gerald is in that gap. I want to yeah. say earlier, but at the same time, like you've got to have one and two in there as well. And I wouldn't mm. have thought one had come out before. So mm. I think yeah, sure. <laughs> are we saying there? Yeah. yeah. Cool. You are correct for oh. two points. Oh my god. Oh, this is too oh my god! This is too stressful. Next, don't like this game. It's too stressful. Next is okay, Red Dead time. Redemption Two. Where do we think that one okay. lives? This one. If it was Red I'm Dead, I'm gonna one. throw it out there that it's after Witcher. I agree. I agree. I think it's after Witcher, and I think it's um. Is it before Odyssey? Because, like, I remember it, um... No, I think it's after. No. No? I, I don't... <laughs> oh, God. I don't want to... <laughs> the... I don't want to better. If we're using Odyssey as, like, the Switch has been released... Yeah. Is it before or after the Switch coming out into the ether? I feel... That's kind of the big moment, so there was a lot of, sort of, things... Where people going, is it going to be on the platform? Is it not going to be on the platform? Yeah, I'm. I so, keep going back to my to my retail days, and in my brain, I, I'm pretty sure I wasn't at EB when Red Dead Two came out. I think at that yeah. point I was at JB. So, uh, which which was in 2017. Okay. So, I feel uh, like after was, Witcher before Odyssey. After Witcher. So there. But I yeah. don't know if it was before. Uh, I, I would say I would say there, because yeah. I'm thinking of particular game shows that Liz and I used to watch. I don't remember this being launched. I think it was in that little dead period during 2016. Okay, hmm. but that is a guess. And there, there's a big there's a big <laughs> yeah. gap there. There's like two years. Yeah. Where yeah. What could go wrong? <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, we're saying there. Oh, uh, hold no, hold on, because I think it came out when I was at JB, which was 2017. That's what you think, go for it. No, Shiza, never mind, lies. I think keep it there. I'm okay. so unsure. Of what are we? What are we do doing? We do, do we just flip a coin? Yeah. Do we just flip a coin? What do you think, Nick? <laughs> I mean, I know. <laughs> I can <laughs> see the date right now. <laughs> <laughs> there. There? Okay. You are one off. Oh, it's up. Oh. It came after Odyssey. But that's... You still get a point. Okay. Still that's get a point. Get. Breath of um, the Wild. Breath of the... Breath of the Wild was a launch title, right? I think so. Um, yeah, yeah. So Breath of the Wild... Uh, before Odyssey. 2018. Because Switch came out in 2017. I'm, I'm almost certain. Oh, right. Yeah. Yes. So I'm... I, it, and if I'm wrong, I like just shoot me, you know, like it's fine. <laughs> um, but uh, I'm gonna go with before Odyssey after Witcher. Before Odyssey after Witcher? Yeah. You are correct. Oh. For two points. Uncharted 4, A Thief's End. This is your second last one that you have to place. I okay. wanna put that before Witcher. Okay. Because I feel like that's very closely tied to like PlayStation 4. Yeah, yeah, that was a big yeah. PlayStation 4 game. You are absolutely right. Um, and if it was in 2014-ish, that would kind of fit contextually and everything, right? Yeah. I can't think of any... Because at the moment we don't have anything in 2014. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Lock it in. Lock it in? Yeah. That is one off. So one point there. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Dang it. Control. Where does control live? Oh, beans. Um, this was recent. <clears throat> uh, I'm. Uh, I think I want to keep it there. You want to keep it exactly there? How do we feel? I'll back your play. 
All right. I think that's fair. Um, hang on. Wait. Mm. I remember someone playing it. Let me just... Um... I remember the cover of this, but that's about it. Yeah. I'm fairly certain it stays there. Okay. Because I think it was 2019 or something. Like, it was at the far end of the tens. I'm okay. pretty sure. Okay. And if I'm wrong, once again, you uh, walk me through the village, let everybody just throw stones at me. Like, it's fine. Shame. It's allowed. Shame! It's fine. It's allowed. I'm pretty sure that's the right spot. Okay. Okay. It is exactly the right oh, spot. I did not want to be stoned. Thank <laughs> you. Oh All right. my god. I didn't want so, to. Uh, <laughs> for time's sake, we are going to call that game there and move on to oh our next game. Oh my god. Oh, we've been discussing tactics so <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm so stupid to such a <laughs> Who's got to be anywhere? Come on. We can do another round. No. Okay. Yeah, well, there's a lot to get through. So, uh, we're only halfway Fair through. Fair enough. So, uh, okay. we're going to jump into our next game, and it's yet another. Pocket Pals Classic. It's a fucking murder mystery again. <laughs> <laughs> it's in the dark. <laughs> I am going to show you up to six screenshots from a single game. Each screenshot will be visible for 10 seconds. The first screenshot will be very obscure. The next will be slightly less and so on and so on until the final screenshot is practically giving it away. If you buzz in, I will pause the timer and let you guess. The penalty, however, is that if you buzz and get it wrong, you're done for the rest of that game, but your teammates will still be able to buzz in. If you get it on the first screenshot, you will earn your team six points. The next screenshot will be worth five and so on until the final one will be worth one point. Is everyone ready? Can everyone minimize chat? We are going to get started. Oh, chat. I should remember to look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Not <laughs> anymore. Remember chat. Uh, the buzzer should be unlocked for everyone. So we're going to get going with the first one. That is so helpful, that image. <laughs> So so yeah, I, I actually watched it pixelate on stream. <laughs> uh, oh. Um. Ruby. Ruby. Is it Five Nights at Freddy's? It sure is oh. Five Nights nice. at Freddy's. Oh, yo, 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 yo. <laughs> That oh, she makes oh, noises oh, and she oh, thinks oh, it's oh, very oh, awful. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We can make noises, Gus. We can. We can. <laughs> <laughs> what do we think this one is? Oh. Middle C. Oh, I was going to say something. Now that it's changed, uh, the Legend Zelda Wind Waker. Unfortunately, not. Something with grass. And water. <laughs> and water. Um. Jap. Is it Pokemon. Uh. The new one? <laughs> oh, what's it called? Pokemon Scarlet? I'll free you, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, Ruby. Is it The Sims 4? It sure is The Sims ah! 4. <laughs> Let's go. Nice. <laughs> really? What? All I would right. not have guessed that. What about this one? Versus zombies? It sure is. Oh my god. I, should have versus wow. zombies. Okay. I know it sounds like a shit thing, but I had it on the first and I was I should have trusted myself. Why didn't you buzz, mate? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, uh okay. coming up next. <laughs> this one. Trust yourself. Trust yourself. That's 
beautiful. It is. Gus. Cult of the Lamb? It sure <laughs> is. Cult of the Lamb. All right. Coming up next. Ruby's having a breakdown. I'm, I'm, I'm not getting energy from the amount of dis distraughtness I'm causing you. Uh, Ruby. Night in the woods. Not night in the woods. Liz. Stray. It sure is. Wow. Thank you, Coastal. Oh, well my God. Done. Coastal well streamed that. That's why I know that game. All right. Fantastic. What do we think well done. about this Slay. one? Slay. Slay. Strike. Say pencil. Jap. Is it Armored Core? Not Armored Core, sorry. Good guess. Good guess, though. Liz. Avatar? Not Avatar. Good guess. Uh, Ruby. Um, is it Horizon Zero Dawn? Not Horizon Zero Dawn, unfortunately. Uh, Middle C. Monster Hunter? Not Monster Hunter. We've got no, Gus and Syntax left. Oh, God. Um. Oh, um. Gus. Is it the game where <laughs> you hop in a big robot and that game is called... Armored Core. Shut up. Uh, that game is called... <laughs> that... Fuck. I'm gonna... That game is called oh. Titanfall. I'm going to give it to you. It was Titanfall 2. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, oh, that's all right. My brain. My poor brain. <laughs> Thank you. All right. What about this one? Middle C. Um, the two moons is throwing me now. I was going to say control. Not control. Jeb? Is it Alan Wake 2? Not Alan Wake 2, unfortunately. Uh, Gus. I could have waited. I'm telling story again, but no one wants to hear this. Is it Kentucky Route Zero? Unfortunately not. Oh, Quantum, this is all you. <laughs> oh, God. Waited. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Yeah, oh. Did, did well, Graham, of course. Oh. <laughs> uh, syntax. Just to clear the pathway for my teammates who are going to get this for me, um, <laughs> is it Life is strange. Life sure is yes. strange, well buddy. Done. That's what I was going to say. Oh. Well done. <laughs> oh, nice. All right. I didn't know which one. <laughs> Next. Uh, syntax. Um. I have now completely and totally blanked on the name <gasps> of the game. I'm starting to doubt myself, so I'll just explain the game and you can tell me if I'm on the wrong track. <laughs> um, the uh, Greek god ones that I was thinking of as, as Stray, but it's not um, like Finir or not Finir. Is there a filibuster <laughs> rule? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need an answer. I'm going to need an answer. Um. I'm going to say it's it's role, but maybe it'll help my team. It's uh, that Phoenix game. 
Yeah, that was no. my brain went there. Uh, Liz, that's yeah. what you were going to say? Unfortunately Yeah, not. Phoenix Immortal Rising. That's Unfortunately not. Are they both out for that? Yes. Okay. My mic is breaking. This is not the right time for this. Ruby. Uh, it's Neon White. It sure is. Oh, oh my god, Gus, I'm so sorry. Jeb. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Jeb. <laughs> I was like, it's not that. <laughs> I specifically said it's not that. <laughs> Syntax. Just because art style, uh, Cuphead? Cuphead is correct. Oh, thanks. Well, oh, my God. God. Oh, my freaking God. God. Nicely oh. done. All right. Beautiful game. Nailed it. Liz. I want to say, uh, like Fable. Not Fable. Gus. Resi 4? Not Resi 4, I'm sorry. Ruby. Resi Village? Not Resi Village. All trying to read that little yeah, sign. Lean, lean in. They are some of the words are deliberately. Um, Jeff. Is this Alan Wake? It Two. sure is. Well, it's Alan Wake. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, very well played. Oh, sir. Very well played. Very well played. <laughs> very well played. <laughs> All right. What do we think about? Could this be Bioshock? <laughs> <laughs> Two infinite. Two infinite? <laughs> like that true false word that's a flag Ruby is this GTA I'm gonna need you to be specific oh, five I'm sorry. Oh, Gus? Is this GTA 6? No. Don't. Jeff? Is it GTA 4? It sure is GTA 4. <laughs> okay, we got there eventually. Is it GTA 1, 2, 3, Vice City 4? Okay. <laughs> um, all right, Liz, can you buzz in for me? Perfect. All right. Uh, this one is just for the one person who is left. Oh, what? Oh, God, but this is going to be a lot of two games. I'm buzzed. Yes. Wait. Yeah, but have you pressed your button? <laughs> Syntax? I could sit here and analyse all the photos, but let's be honest, I didn't get my Nintendo Switch, so I don't know. <laughs> but for, for posterity's sake, is it Mario Odyssey? It is Mario Odyssey. Congratulations. He finally got his... Finally got it right. Um, so um, thank you. Well done. You don't get five points for a tailored no. point just for no. them, right? Okay, no, no, no. That was just for the bit. That was just for the bit. All Wait, right. But it says five points on the picture. Um, what, well, you're going to come onto the okay. end and lie? Yeah, yeah, I am. Ruby has a oh. gun. Careful. All right. Uh, just before we I head to our next break, we are going to check the scores. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> All right, I revealed Inferno first last time, so I'll reveal Quantum this time. Quantum, you guys are currently sitting on a neat 50 points. Inferno, nice. you guys are currently on 48 points. Ooh, Ooh. So close. 
Very close. All right, really we're going to take a quick break and come back with our final games of the night, which are going to let our teams earn big points. We'll see you very soon. <laughs> Talent. Hold it. Is that really the controller you're going to game with? Well, sure. Haven't you heard? This one's got all the famous buttons. Circle, triangle, square, X, and more. Well, there's gaming. And then there's gaming in style. Here, try this. Oh, we are robots. Well, it certainly looks amazing, but what makes it more edgy than my PS Edge back home? Well, take a guess. How many kills in Call of Duty do you typically get with your regular controller? Well, I suppose three. That's right. And now guess how many kills in Call of Duty you'll get with this We Are Robots themed controller. I mean, four? Higher. Seven? Guess again. But it couldn't be nine. It's exactly nine. Wow. Well, that's a KD ratio I could get behind. But hang on, what's the catch? There's no catch. We Are Robots can improve all of your favorite gaming statistics simply by making you look way cooler and implanting you with nano components through thumbstick injectors for robot-like response times. Wow, what the f***? Welcome back. In that break, you saw words from Black Death and Jep, uh, as well as the classic We Are Robots ad. These last two games are massive point earners, so it's all going to be decided here. We're going to jump into the next game now, and this one was a huge hit last week. Nope. Scratch that. Reverse it. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Okay. Yes. The server. Wait, nope. Switch. That. Reverse it. God. <laughs> Switch that, reverse it is a quick fire game where players are presented with a prompt that is the inverse of the title or subtitle of a video game. For example, and I'll use the same example as last time, if I showed you the prompt, the first of them, the answer I would be looking for for you to buzz in and say would be the last of Mortal us. Phoenix Rising. Yes. <laughs> Your buzzer <laughs> will be reset after every second correct answer. So that meaning if you guess one and you get it right, you're out for the next prompt but you're back in for the prompt after each prompt is worth only one point but there's 50 points available here so uh, if we're ready we'll get i'll ask you to minimize chat <laughs> the and, um, when you need him. we will get going okay yeah. what do we think is blue alive condemnation ruby red dead redemption, red dead redemption is correct um, I, sorry, I have a lot of clicking to do here to make this work. Uh, what away, up? Buddy. Next, away. we've got plastic poverty gas. 
syntax. Metal Gear Solid? Metal Gear Solid is maybe, correct. Yeah, maybe. All right. What about weak, dirty reality? <laughs> Gus. Strong, clean <laughs> fantasy. <laughs> I'm sorry. It is not that. Uh, <laughs> anyone else want to buzz in? I mean, I'm right. <laughs> oh, 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 Ruby. Oh. That's Power Wash Simulator, baby. It sure is Power Wash Simulator. Oh, 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 let's go. All right. Sorry. I'm just going to unfreeze everyone. It's one of my favorite games. All right. What about this one? Pet Demons. Stray Gods. It sure is Stray Gods. Well done. All right. What about this one? Daughters of the Desert. Uh, Ruby. Sons of the Forest. Sons of the Forest is correct. Uh, next up. Alive for Nightfall. Syntax. Dead by Daylight? Dead by Daylight is the correct answer. All right. Next up. The Youth Buns. Ruby. <laughs> Wait. She's Yiggity. filibusting. No, you got to move on. Yeah, uh, 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 no, it's, 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 it's... No. Nah. Let, nah. let it go. Uh, all right. Anyone else? Oh, no, I didn't have it. I just was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh no no no! Can I have it? Can I have it? Please! Yeah, can I have it? Buzz. No no no! Please You're please! please. I already buzzed. buzzed in. Yeah yeah. The Elder Scrolls. That's correct. Thanks. It is the Elder Scrolls. I just needed a minute. All right. <laughs> All right. What about this one? Country Desolation. <laughs> Gus. City Skylines. Unfortunately not. Jeff? Oh, but mine is so good. <laughs> um, city. City Builders? I'm sorry, it's not. All right, I'm gonna give it five more seconds. Syntax? Rebel Alliance? <laughs> Unfortunately not. Okay, this one was Disco Elysium. Oh, it was all right. Very clever, mate. <laughs> ball, ball animal Copenhagen country. Ruby. Oh wait, no, never, never mind. Sorry, I thought I thought I knew what it was, and and it's not that. That's okay. You have, you you have to answer until the next person buzzes in. Okay. Is that how this works? Oh uh, come on! You can just sit there and buzz. Oh. Oh, it's. Jeff. Wait, can I buzz and not answer for a bit? Yeah, <laughs> yes, you fucking can. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Liz. Man. <laughs> Batman ah, Arkham City. <gasps> Batman Liz, Arkham City is the correct answer. Well done. Yes. Well done. Uh, Good. <laughs> I chose Copenhagen for that one because it is the one with the highest mental health, the city with the highest mental health rate in the world. <laughs> All right, what about this one? The obvious of human continent. Uh, Gus. I'm doing a ruby, but uh. The... <laughs> My first guess doesn't make sense anymore, so I'm gonna think on this. I thought it's something dumb. It's just not a game. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm gonna reveal it. C, the something C. The, the, the mystery of the animal C. Middle C? Is it the... Oh. I was going to say, uh, 
See, the curse of the Obra Dinn, but no. No. Okay, I'm going to reveal this one. This one was the secret of Monkey Island. Oh, 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 well done. That's good. All right, what about this one? Barbarism. <laughs> Middle C. Humanity. <laughs> Great guess, oh. but unfortunately not. Oh. I'll give her a point. <laughs> <laughs> The chat's against us. You're against us. Give us something. Uh, Liz. <laughs> Civilization. Civilization oh. is correct. Oh. Nice. All right. What about this one? The sitting life. Uh, Ruby. No. No. Wait. I uh. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna. I, we're gonna. We're gonna filibuster oh, this. The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead is correct. What? Oh, no, oh, my, brain just went, my brain just went oh, straight to the standing so, dead. I, like, I, I went to like the, the standing. The stalling. All Come right. On. No more stalling, please. Do not buzz okay, in until okay, you are fine, ready to say something. Fine, fine, fine. All right. What about this one? Laughs of the peasants. Uh, Liz. Tears of the kingdom. Tears oh. of the kingdom is correct. Well done. All right. Play. What are we? Oh. She had, she had an answer straight up. She buzzed, so, you know. Hourglass yeah. cats. Uh, Ruby. Oh, no, it's not sleeping dogs. Um, no, it's not. Uh, Gus. No, it's gone. Not the same answer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyone else? Ah, uh, no. Fuck it. You can chat it to your team if you oh. like, but. Uh, Watchdogs. Watchdogs oh. is the correct answer. Mm. All right, what about this one? Sinners column. Let me, sorry, let me just reset those buzzers. Uh, oh, wait. Gus. Saints Row. Saints Row is correct. All right, <clears throat> what about this one? Packing. Ruby. I'm buzz, I'm buzzed. Unpacking. <laughs> I'm buzzed again. <laughs> Am I, can I not, oh. Yeah, because you got the last one right. You got the last one right. That's, That's why. You do this. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, what a grandfather clock. Huh? Gus? Oh, shit. It's not this. But it's clever, so I get a point for Sands of Time. <laughs> I'm sorry, no. Guys, guys, no. chat, 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 chat. Liz. Firewatch? Firewatch is correct. Thank you, Ruby. Oh, You're welcome. I'm sure if I was looking at chat, they'd be saying, Girls No, well. I mean our Give Discord chat, you. Mainstream yeah. of the Wolf? <laughs> Gus? Is that. No. Gus. <laughs> I'm out. Oh. Oh, oh, you meant to know the answer straight away, Gus. Interesting. Buzzing in and just vamping. All right, anyone I'm else? Out. I'm out. You can buzz me out. Buzz me out. Anyone else? Mm. I was gonna say, I didn't hear any buzzing from Team Quantum, so. Uh... Uh, yeah, because we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so, All right, we didn't buzz. I'm gonna reveal. Wait, wait, hold for the dinner decision of not knowing. <laughs> What's the opposite of a wolf? I don't this know. one was oh. Cold of the oh. Lamb. Oh. Uh. Anyway. All right. Every Cold of the Lamb thing. The group I'm chat wrong. where you guys came up for this must have absolutely popped off. Oh, oh no. my god. <laughs> oh. It must have been so good. Brain and skin. Ruby. Skull and bones. Skull and bones is correct. Oh. It's not even out yet. I went heart and soul. I'm like, no. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well done. <clears throat> Chance two, the first abstract. I will say the two is the same in both answers. <laughs> um. No one? All right, I'm going to um, reveal it. No, 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 <laughs> Just guess, Gus. We have a guess. Just guess. Gus? Oh, oh, Something Jesus. to the final reality. Uh, it is the... Sorry. Liz? Destiny? 
to <gasps> the final shape. Yeah. Well Believing. done. Oh. Wow. Well done. <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> oh, Liz, you're Wow. Incredible. Well done. All right. What about this one? Scissors. Thank you. Ruby? Papers, please. Papers, please is correct. <laughs> I thought, I, my thought was rock, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite game. <laughs> All right. Okay. I love this one. <clears throat> Prince flat ass. Show's over. <laughs> Guys, chat. Look, look in Discord. Liz. Princess Peach Showtime. Princess Peach Showtime is the correct answer. We are such an effective team. We're good. All right. What about this one? Stop yelling and everybody implodes. Oh, uh, middle C. Oh. Keep talking and nobody explodes. Keep talking yeah. and nobody explodes is the correct well answer. Done. Well done. Yes. All right. What about this one? Avoid Max. Oh. Ruby. Pikmin? Pikmin is the correct answer. <laughs> wow. Well nice. done. Right. Oh, delightful. Eating Daddy? Gus? Cooking Mama. Cooking Mama is correct. I thought it was drinking Mummy, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> 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 no. Okay. Uh, right. Text of irresponsibility. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Ruby. Call of Duty. Call of Duty is correct. <laughs> um, oh. Nice. All right, you guys are killing this. Really? All right. Yeah. Ooh. Poo video games. <laughs> That's it. That's the name. That's the win right there. Um, Gus. Wii Sports. Wii Sports is the correct <laughs> answer. That rock. That's good. Oh, That's dumb. really good. That was That's the winner great, right there. That was so good. Well done. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What about this one? Ready the audio job. Oh, 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 guys. Uh, wait, no, I can buzz. Ruby. <laughs> I went to send it in the group chat. Uh, it's Bluey the video game. It sure is Bluey the video game. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Blind Windows Explorer. This is rude. I mean, it's not rude, but it's very specific. Middle C. Uh, uh, C. Oh, no, God. I don't know what I'm typing. I'm just no, typing no, no, no. I'm not looking at the it. chat. I'm trying <laughs> to... Um, Steve Farah. Sorry. Unfortunately, not. Sorry. Um, it's all right. <laughs> All right. I'm going to reveal. Oh, we're having fun with this. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm leading that way to Ruby. Or one yeah. of the other, one of, one of the other ones. Firefox. Oh. 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 Uh, uh, no. Maybe. Uh. No, it's, it's wrong. Um. <laughs> It's so wrong. Ruby, I'll let you buzz if you have an idea. It's not right. So, no. Okay. Um, <laughs> um, we're, we're leaning towards, like, like uh, something. Okay, I'll give you a hint. Or... Uh, the Windows Explorer is not an uh, internet browser. Oh? It's the thing that you look at files with. Oh, good, because we're like, yeah. see Netscape, see Bing, see Files. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Thing that you see files with. Yeah. So what's the what's the opposite of Windows and what would what do you use for what do you use to look at files in that? I'm um, yeah, I, I know what you're saying. I'm just Jeff? Is it viewfinder? Oh, oh, oh my god, that's so cool. Yeah. Wow. wow. That's just uh, that's that just is just like see things. See files. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's so clever. 
<laughs> All right. Crying. What about this one? Big brain. Ruby? Oh, no. Um, big brain. I was going to say little nightmares. It's not right. No, it's not little nightmares. Sorry. Buzz me up. Little C. It's all right, Middle C. I can see your group chat, and the Twitch chat is also saying the same thing. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about that. All right, well, chat. I take back everything I said brain, about you. Half of it goes to the <laughs> Opposite of brain? Um, yeah. That, God, that bit was the second yeah. one. What do you mean, opposite of brain? There's no opposite of brain. <laughs> Middle Rain C. just is. Atomic Heart? Atomic Heart Atomic is correct. Oh, oh wow. my god. Wow. Oh my god. god. Oh my god. <laughs> Incredible. All right. I was going to say small dick. <laughs> <laughs> that is the opposite, isn't it? <laughs> How about Tent Flopper? Ruby? House Flipper. House Flipper is correct. All right. All right. You All cheeky right. boy. All you right. cheeky little boy. <laughs> All right. What about this right. one? Uh, Mario's studio apartment. <laughs> Gus. <laughs> the Peachy's haunted mansion. Oh. oh. I mean, yeah. Yeah. What's, what's it? What's it actually called? You Luigi's. added a word that you didn't need to add. Oh, Luigi's. Uh, hey. Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> Luigi's Mansion. Luigi's Mansion. <laughs> Just what we were looking for there. But it's haunted as well. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was extra information. All right. Sorry. Uh, certainty of drought. <laughs> uh, middle C. Risk of rain. Risk of rain is correct. <gasps> wow. Oh, incredible. All right. Chaos. Fortnite oh, Friday. Oh, oh. Ruby? <laughs> Control? Control is correct. Nice. Nice. Let's go. Oh, why did we hire a writer? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I I really like this one. <clears throat> Dwelling on it. Middle C? Uh, oh, oh, um, oh, oh. Oh my god, it's just gone on my head. Sorry. All right. I'm going to time you out. Getting over it. Getting over it is correct. <laughs> I'll be honest. I quickly looked at the chat and I was like, small dick. <laughs> <laughs> you can say some dwell on it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting over it. It's okay. All right. <clears throat> moving on. All right. Moving on. Um, I hate Katamari. Ruby. We love Katamari. We sure do. Yeah. Because the there's no opposite of Katamari. Katamari. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Same thing. All right. <clears throat> Regard? <laughs> oh. Oh, my God. This game came out in 2013 on... Game Pass, I believe it was an Xbox exclusive. I may be wrong about that. It's very gross. Uh, uh. Jep? Oh. No, I mean Scorn. It is. I'm going to oh. give it to you. It was Scorn. I swear I that was like, Scorn. Disregard? <laughs> <laughs> I think you just oh, ordered it. Early access, like ages ago. Mm, right? Oh, all right. Yeah. All right. Um, Wario and Shadow fail to qualify. <laughs> Ruby? Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was great. I would play that. I would play that. Oh, man. Give me a little march in the parade. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> <Get out of here. laughs> All right. Heterosexual woman listening out of a glass mound. MP3. Oh, 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 oh. No. I'm just going to buzz preemptively Liz? because Ruby's yeah, getting yeah. very excited and I'm going to oh. vamp because everybody else is going to no, mind. I'm going to no, dance no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So queer man peering into a rock pool.jpg. 
Queer man peering into a rockpool.jpg is the correct Shouts answer. Shout out, Posse Ghost. I love you. All right. I have no idea, but Ruby got very excited. <laughs> we got two Australian more. Game. It's made in Sydney. We got two more. Uh, geriatric regular pirate rabbers, bulk is forgiveness. Oh, oh, oh. You can buzz, Ruby. You can buzz, Ruby. Oh, I can. I can. I can. Uh, uh. Ruby. I keep forgetting. Uh, uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's ah. Revenge is the correct answer. Oh, nice. All right, oh here comes God. the last How one. How do you do this? The yeah. very last one. <clears throat> Sorry, this is long. No, I need which labor left. So there I stop. Later, you'll hear me obfuscate us. Oh. Okay. Oh. Gus? Yes. I don't need <laughs> liberal, right? <laughs> So there I go. Soon you'll taste me. What the fuck is obs ob obfuscate me? I'm sorry. Uh, Listalia. I'm sorry. Does she too. need to say the full thing? Yeah. Yes, sure. you want those games, well here you go. Um uh, I have to I have to right. give it to the first person who's close because I don't think anyone will get the actual oh, correct title. <laughs> so yes, it was yeah, you want those games, right? So here you go. Now let's see you clear them. Just, All right. I didn't remember the last part. Oh, yeah, man. yeah. I don't know. I, I wasn't expecting anyone to get that. Um wow. All right. Wow. We are going to jump into our last game of the night. And it's one that we haven't seen in a while. Okay. In this game, I'm going to present. Oh, it's a loot llama. <laughs> I'm going to present everyone with a category, and each team will bid to determine how many items in that category they think they, as a team, can name from memory in two minutes. Whichever team bids okay. the highest is the one that gets to do it, and they must name all of the items they think they can bid. For each item that you name correctly, you'll get a point, but only if you make it to the amount that you bid in the two minutes. So you, I would suggest being conservative with your bids. So if you bid 10 okay. and you only guess nine before the time's up, you get nothing. If you don't make it to you the amount you, nothing. if you don't make Good it to the amount, you, <laughs> if you don't make it to the amount you you bid, the other team will get thirty seconds to finish it off, and if they can finish off all the other items, they will steal all the points. Does that make sense? Okay. Cool. So there are some huge <laughs> point scores available in this round with a lot of swing Maybe possible. At this stage, the points are still pretty close, so it's anyone's game. Um. If we're ready, I'll ask you to minimize chat and we'll get you going. You don't need to lie, Nick. It's fine. <laughs> Nick, what? Nick, can we, ha can we just have the instructions again? I'm going to be so real. I straight up do not get it. Okay. Well, I, I will give you the first example and we'll, we'll see how we go. Okay. Okay, um, the first category is going to be Overwatch 1 Heroes. There are 33 available. Team Inferno, I want you to bid on... Give me a bid of how many, thing, how many you think you can get as a team in two minutes. We want to do this actively and with our voices, or we're going to go back and forth until one team uh, doesn't, uh, until sure. one team passes and challenges the other team. Um. Okay. So I think we can do one, two, three, three. <laughs> sure. No, we can start there. We Let's can start, start with there. three. Let's we'll start, start with, with three. three. Okay. So Team uh, Inferno have put in a bid of three. Team Quantum. How many do you think you can do in two minutes? You can challenge them to do the three, or you can say a higher bid. I reckon uh, we could go higher. To... I think we could do six. Six? six. I think six is good. Yep. Okay, yeah. you're saying six? Yeah. Inferno, can yeah. you do better than six in two minutes? Um, seven? <laughs> yeah. Seven? Quantum. Yeah. Or seven? Oh. Can you do better than seven? Um, oh, wait, eight. eight. Eight? All right. All right. Let's just keep going. I think... I mean, the problem is we're probably double guessing ones we have. I think... 
I could. I think do, I could name more. I could do ten. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. Quantum. Yeah. Do you want to challenge them to do ten, or do you want to go higher? This is just the example, right? It doesn't count, right? No, this counts. <laughs> no, wait, this is <laughs> oh game. god. Yeah, this is just. Gonna no, we're just practicing. Okay. Right? This is yeah, just yeah, practicing. Yeah, yeah. Um, look. There would be plenty of categories and plenty of opportunities, so don't. I okay. I could probably name ten. I don't know if we will end up naming the same ten. Is the problem? Okay, are you challenging Inferno to do ten? What do you think, Ruby, Liz? We'll, we'll ha uh, have a look in the in the chat and see if, oh, right. if you've got on top of that. Um, I can't think of any more other than that. Uh, All right, I'm gonna have to press you to commit to cause something. Because if you can add. Uh, right. Yep. Can. Um, We've already said him, so yep. I think I think <laughs> you're challenging. We can probably get it. No. 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 Oh, uh, yeah. As in, like, yes. we're challenging them to do challenging it. them to do ten. All right. Yes. Yes. Really. Inferno, you're up. Here we go. We we sell bid. So we have to do ten. <laughs> you have to do ten in the two minutes. <laughs> okay. We okay. ready? Here we go. Yeah. Let's Your two start. minutes starts yeah. now. Tracer. Winston, Mercy, McCree. By the what way, was that I'm one, sorry? Chat. McCree. I'm reading our chat that we've been collating. So McCree that... is also um, called Cassidy. McCree or like, Cassidy. Like, name. Um, Doomfist, Lucio. What was that one, sorry? Lucio, Lu Lucio. Yep. Lucio. Uh, Arissa, Reinhardt. Diva, my main, love Diva. Uh, and we'll go Reaper. Uh, Reaper is correct. Well done. Damn. You just gained yourself well 10 points. Uh, the full list was that. All right. What the fuck is Wrecking Ball? Right. Yeah. It's a hamster. Hey, <laughs> it's a hamster category. There's a hamster. Amazing. Uh, I will give Quantum first right of refusal on the next category. Careers available in the Sims 4 base game. Um, uh, you can start uh, low. What? Yeah, one. One? <laughs> Whoops, sorry. I keep That's clicking the wrong button. That's more than one. One. All right, uh, Inferno, can you do more than one? Little C, Jeb, you got anything? <laughs> mm, um, I take a stab at two. Yeah, two. <laughs> yeah. two? We, can, we can do... We could do five. No. Yes. Interesting. I was going to make it up, but yeah, we could do that. All right. <laughs> okay, yeah, Quantum, sure. I'm going to need you to commit pretty quick. Six. Six. Inferno. Um, if you don't commit a number. No. Nah. I think we should challenge. We should, we think challenge, we should challenge. Yeah. All right, challenging. Yeah. Okay, Quantum. Yeah. Let me hear six Sims 4 base game um, careers. Just asking, does this also include part time jobs? Uh. I don't know. <laughs> I'm looking at a list of careers that are available in The Sims 4. That's the only information that I have. All right, All right. All right let's um, see how we go. And so if we get one wrong, that's it. No, no, no. You can, oh, you can keep guessing. Keep guessing. Keep guessing. Oh, okay. Okay. okay, sorry, sorry. Okay, um, uh, there's the, the legal career. Uh, like, I, don't, lawyer? I don't have a wow. lawyer. That's not a real job. Politician? She's a lawyer. I don't wow. have a politician. What? A journalist? I don't have wow. journalist. Artist? I have artist. I'll give that to you as Nacta. painter. Uh, I do not. I think entertainer fits that. Yep. Yeah. Um, uh, if there is part-time jobs in it, barista. Barista is there. Fast food worker. Fast food employee is there. Uh, babysitter. Babysitter is there. And um, uh, computer. Culinary <laughs> is there. Well done. Okay. That's six points for you guys. All right. Okay, yes. Yeah, so it is. That's it is part-time jobs. 
the Hello, remainder was that. Okay, Inferno, you are going to have first I, right I, of refusal. Of, Wait, I, I, isn't journalist writer? I always thought about being business. Yeah. Um. Okay. No, it's different. It's different. Never mind. It's different. I, I, I think that's like author. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How does the right of refusal work? So this is. I, it's just you're gonna have first opportunity to start on the next category. So before I reveal it, because we could be sitting here forever if you guys are allowed to just make lists in chat, I'm gonna give you ten <laughs> seconds to sure. select a number or challenge. Okay. So the next category. Games in which Rosalina is playable. There are 25. How many you think you can do? Five. I think start with five. Okay. Yeah. Quantum, how many do you think you can do? Zero. <laughs> Zero for me. Like well. one. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna let them have it. Yeah. Be challenging? No. No, go for it. Okay. Uh, Okay. All right, Wait, Inferno. Are they challenging or they're not? I think so. Mario, um, Mario Golf. Eight. All right, we ready? Your two minutes yeah, sure. are oh. going to start <laughs> now. Mario Kart 8. Mario Kart 8 is there. Mario. Super Smash. Oh. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Keep going. Yeah. Super, oh, Super Smash Bros. I'm guessing at this point. Super Smash Brothers oh, Ultimate okay. is there, yep. Um. Okay, Sparks of Hope is the Rosalina rabbit. Uh, I don't think I have that on my list, no. Okay, uh, Mario, what about a Mario Party? Mario Party 5, what we're up to? 1, oh. Mario Party 2, Mario Party 3, No, Mario. no, it's just like... Oh. <laughs> 8. Mario Party 8. eight. <laughs> Did Mario Golf, did you say? Yeah, Mario Golf. She's in a Mario Golf. I know that. Yep. Um, the, um, I know which do one. you want to give me a... Mario Golf 2. Mario Golf <laughs> Ultimate. Mario Golf Switch. Mario Golf. No, hang on. Mario... Mario Tennis. Is there a Mario Tennis? Mario Tennis? Mario Tennis Aces I'll give to you. Yep, yep. We'll, 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 and we will take it, sir. Um, Another Mario Kart? Mario Kart 7? She is in Mario Kart 7. Yeah, well done. Kart 6? No. No, that's pretty cool. Uh, what about Mario Party? Super Star. Oh. She is in Mario Party 10. Oh. But she is also in Mario Party Superstars. Well done. That is oh, five nice. points for you guys. There's so many. There's <laughs> a lot. Hold on, hold on. There is a keep lot. Keep that up for a sec. Sure. That is. Cr She's. Wait, she is a player playable in Mario character. 3D World? Yeah. World Tour. What? Wow. I never got to play her. And Super Mario 3D. That's not true. That's made that's, up. That's <laughs> no, that's real. <laughs> no, that's a lie. <laughs> that's that real. Right. All right. That's crazy. Okay. Uh. Quantum, you're going to get first guess at this one. How many franchises that crossed over with Fortnite in 2023 do you think you can name? There are 36. Oh, God. <clears throat> yeah. In 2023. Mm. Only in 2023. Okay, I'm going to need oh God. just a, an opening bid. Let's start. Let's just start low. Yeah. Start with three. Yeah. Three? Cool. Three. Inferno? Yeah. Can you do better than three? Five. Yep. Quantum, can you do better than five? Uh, Six. Six? Inferno. <laughs> Surely we've guessed. It's counting. We'll go seven. Seven? Oh, okay. Jet seven. Vacuum. Yep, okay, Jet, let's go. Quantum. Eight. Eight. <laughs> Inferno. Ten. Ten. Quantum. Eleven. <laughs> All right. Inferno. Thoughts? <laughs> <laughs> 
the problem is that in 2023 part, I feel like I. Yeah, let's leave them. Let's hoist them by their own petards. All right. Okay. Here what we go. Like... Hoist away. Team Quantum, you need to name for me 11 franchises that crossed over with Fortnite in 2023. Your time starts now. Okay. Lego? Lego that, is correct. That last year. Family Guy? Family Guy is correct. Star Wars? Star Wars is correct. WWE? John Wick? WWE is correct. John Wick is correct. Alien? I do not have Alien. Okay. Teenage Marvel? Mutant Ninja Turtles? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles is correct and Marvel is correct. Naruto? Oh, we're all going crazy. <laughs> Naruto is not there, Syntax. sorry. So Syntax? is fucking Fortnite. <laughs> DC? Uh, I do not have a DC listed here. Uh, My Hero Academia. My Hero Academia is there. Attack on Titan. Attack on Titan is there. Liz, what did you say, sorry? The Witcher. The Witcher is no. there. Um, Look, technically Rocket League, okay? Alan yeah, no, Rocket League is there. Well done. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's... Yeah. Well done. Uh, that is 11 oh my points God. for you guys. Oh, my God. Just last oh my God, of course. That was all oh that happened God. just in 2023. Oh, we should have said 12 because we also had Dragon Ball Z with us as well. Yeah. Damn. All right. Video, I would video, have also video got game Transformers. Dead. But, yeah. <laughs> okay. Drama. And we also had the weekend as well. It did. This one's Pokemon oh. games featuring Team Rocket. I got nothing. I've got six. Six? Good. All right. Can you guys do better than six? Uh. Are you counting like? You know how like Pokemon comes out with two games at a time kind of generation? Yep. So you're counting both games rather yep. than... They are separate like games eight. in this list. Eight. Eight. Inferno, can you Ruby do better than eight? eight but she... I don't know if Ruby... Uh... Are you including remakes as well? Yep. All right, Inferno, I'm going to need you to press you. Ten. Ten? Quantum, can you do better than ten? Uh, 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 hold on. Let me, let me, let me count. Let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Inferno, can you do eleven? I could, I could. I want to leave them on 11 or. Oh. All right, I'm going to need an answer. 12. 12? Ah, she did it. Can you guys <laughs> do better than 12? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, Maybe not. six, seven, eight. 13. Inferno? Uh, um, 14. <laughs> oh, my God. oh my God. Can you guys do better than 14 or do you want to challenge them to do 14? Do 14. I okay. This. I think I we were going to roll it up. <laughs> All right, Whew. your two minutes to name 14 Pokemon games featuring Team Rocket starts now. Pokemon Yellow. Pokemon Blue. Pokemon Red. Pokemon Gold. Pokemon Silver. Pokemon Heart Gold. Pokemon Soul Silver. Pokemon Crystal, Pokemon Stadium, no, uh, Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Pokemon Let's Go Eevee, Pokemon Snap. I don't have them in Snap. Uh, um, Pokemon 
Uh, leaf green. Pokemon fire red. Pokemon green? Um, Pokemon... Uh... Ruby. Go! Pokemon... Yes. Um... um <laughs> do you know any Pokemon games, guys? Um, uh... Pokemon Go. What was that one, sorry? Pokemon... Pokemon Go? Well yeah! done. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Amazing. Incredible. Oh my God. <laughs> nailed it. That Absolutely. That was, that was nailed impressive. It. That was very All impressive. Right. My Quantum. fiance who's watching this, please still love me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, chat is absolutely losing their minds. Uh, <laughs> oh All right. This one. Back pocket 2023 guest hosts. This oh, is oh. people who sat on the couch in 2023. Uh, Quantum, how many off the off the dome do you think you can do? You can start low and bat it, bat it back and forth. I'm going to press you for an answer. Quantum, talk to me. Come oh, on! Sorry, that's oh, sorry, Quantum. That's, right. that's you guys. Yes. Hi. Uh, let's let's start with five. And we'll, we'll go up. Cool. Inferno, can you Ten. do more than five? Ten. 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 Oh, uh, I didn't realize Quantum. it was talking last. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> um. Uh, eleven. Eleven. Inferno. Um. 15. 15? Ish. Uh, <laughs> Quantum. Ish, right? And, uh, uh, and 16. 16? Inferno? Uh, 17. 17? Are we including Quantum? guests during the 12-hour, like, super... Stream? No. Oh. Ooh. And not like game dev interviews. No. No, they're gonna be on, These the, are couch. on the couch. Yeah. As well, in they are in the YouTube thumb. On the couch. In the YouTube thumbnail. The YouTube thumbnail. Eighteen. Eighteen? Yeah. Inferno? This is pushing it. I want to say 19. Leave it up to you, Gus. I feel like I could say 19-ish. Okay. <laughs> are you doing the full 20 or are you challenging them to do 19? All right. Okay. Say 19, Gus. All I, right. I'm already 19. Say 19. Here we go. Team Inferno, you are about to name 19 people who guest hosted Back Pocket in the year our Lord 2023. Let's go. Steph Panacasio. Steph Panacasio. Uh, Nat 10, uh, Nat 10 T, 10, 10 T Nat. T 10 Nat, yep. T 10 Nat, thank you. Uh, Luna, Tuna and Tolga? Luna and yes, Tolga. Tolga. Yep, um, uh, let's go Jordan Rascopoulos. Jordan Rascopoulos. Uh, let's go Reaps. Reaps. Let's go with Tom Walker. Tom Walker. Um, let's go with Montaigne. Montaigne. Let's go with Miles. Miles. Let's go with... No, not Ruby. <laughs> uh, Ruby is one of them. Yes! yes! Oh, Barjo! Barjo! Them Barjo! Barjo! Ruby. Barjo um, is there. Nicrotex. Nicrotex? Nicrotex. Yes. Guys, yell these out. We need them if we Um, skill up? Um, Who, sorry? So again? Skill up? Skill up was uh, not 2023. Well, oh. Levin, oh, no. Levins? Levins? Levins. Yes, Levins. Yes, uh, Raj. Raj? Raj? Uh, Harry. Harry. Harry Jun? Harry Jun. Harry Jun. Yeah. Um, GFD. Uh, GFD? Good. Um, uh... Curveball. For you. What about 
anyone from the Jacob Janaka? Anyone from the powerhouse no, special? No, we don't have anyone from the oh, powerhouse special. Oh, you fucked up. That's the only one I remember too. Um, uh... Oh, I'm um, Raj. Raj. He's Raj. already there. Oh, we've already, he's already there. I can't. He's already breathe. there. Um, little Will. He doesn't count. Peyton? Wow. Peyton does not count. <laughs> um, All right, your time is shit. up. So here's back? how this is, is going to work. Again? Sure. Uh, all right, Quantum, you are going to get 30 yep. seconds to name the last three. And if you get it, you steal all 19 points. Here we go. Your 30 seconds starts now. Uh, Ali. Ali. Um. Josh. Who? Josh. No. Uh, Jens. Uh, uh, oh, um, um, um. Oh, God. Uh, hit my tongue. Um. Uh, uh, Loz. And. Oh. Okay. Can I buzz? How do I buzz? No. I'm locked. I'm locked. You can't buzz. Buzzes that, are off for this over. game. It's over. Oh, okay. But I can. I. If you want to tell me, I can't. Year? I can't. I can't. I can't give you anything. But I will reveal the final two, unless you want to say it, Gus. I know one. There's two to go. There's other, uh, not other. There's Nat, ten, t, t ten Nat, and there's Nat as well. A Nat T. Yeah, Nat T yeah. was the other one, and Scrunt we counted. Um, oh bullshit! <laughs> I thought of Scrunt. Oh my so god. So nobody gets the points. Nobody gets the points for that one, unfortunately. Okay. Oh, All right. And, and you don't oh. want to give me anything for getting the last bit there? <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Okay, we've got 48 options in this one. Playable oh. characters in Mario Kart 8. Oh Quantum, Ruby, Syntax, and Liz, that's you. How many do you think you can <laughs> name? All right, you got me. Um, oh, oh, 10. Start with 10? 10? Uh, sure. Inferno. 20. 20? Quantum? Yeah. I've got a confession to make about my Nintendo knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> Is it different to the, all the other confessions? <laughs> oh, yeah, it 30? does go to Super Fade. 30? Yeah. What? Did you? Th three. Th okay. Yeah. Are you guys going to do more than 30 or do you want to challenge them to 30? Remember, you've got to do this in two minutes. That's the hardest fucking part. Mm. I don't know if anyone can read 30 names out in that time oh let's should we let him go and then we can clean up the rest in 30 um, seconds well you get what 25 i th i think let's let's let them have a go okay go for it no. team quantum i'm gonna try and get my mouse clicking arm as ready as i can You've got two minutes to name 30 playable characters from Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Let's go. All right, Mario. <laughs> Baby Mario. Baby Mario. Luigi. Luigi. I'm going to assume you've said Luigi. Baby, Baby Luigi. Luigi. Yep. Yep. Uh, Peach. Sorry. Baby Peach. Uh, Bowser. Yep. Uh, and um, Bowser Jr. Yep. And uh, oh. Rosalie. Oh. Rosalina, yep. Rosalina. Toad. Toad. Baby Toadette. Rosalina. Baby Rosalina. Toadette. Uh, Boo. Boo. King Boo, sorry. King Boo, yes. Uh, Koopa Trooper. Koopa Trooper. Shy Guy. Shy Guy. Um, Donkey Zelda. Kong. Donkey Kong. Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong. Donkey Kong. Uh, Funky Kong. Okay, um, uh, uh, Daisy? Daisy. Is, is there a baby Daisy? There is a baby Daisy. Okay, cool. Um, uh, Metal Mario? Metal Mario is there. 
Rose gold peach. Uh, I'll give you two. Pink gold peach. Yeah, sorry, pink gold peach. Uh, dry bones. Dry bones is there. Um. Oh, what's the what's the, the Oh, yeah, Link. Link is there. Um, villager. The villager is there. Isabel. Isabel is also there. The me. The me. Um, um, um. Is the ghost face kind of character? That's shy guy. Uh, uh, oh, Lakitu. Lakitu is there. Um, Yoshi. Yoshi. Oh, and Birdo. And Birdo. Holy yeah. shit. Can I, can I veto? What do you mean? Probably what? not. <laughs> Diddy Kong? Yeah, Diddy I Kong. I said Diddy Kong. I don't think he, is Diddy Kong? He is, from yep. the new one. Yep. I remember because I wrote a whole article about being like, we need more Kongs. Yeah. And I said, Fair enough. Kong should be in it. I didn't know Diddy had been in there for a while. Okay. Fair cool. Um, all right. Well done. Mm, mm, mm. We Duty nailed it. Main series Ooh. games. Oh. Oh. Inferno, oh, wait, you're got, first up. Jeff's back. Jeff's back. Yay, Jeff's back. Ten. Um, Ten? Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is this, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Quantum, can you do more than ten? Uh, Eleven. Eleven? Inferno. Twelve. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Ish. Twelve. Uh, quantum. Thirteen. Inferno. Did you say fifteen? Yep. Nice. I'm asking. Oh, I said I'm asking. <laughs> could we? I didn't say we could. <laughs> Fuck. Can you guys do better than fifteen? Uh, what do you guys think? I'd say let him hang. Let him do it. Let him do it? Ah. Oh. All right, Inferno, it. you are going to have two minutes to name 15 Call of Duty main series Call games. Up. All right, here we go. Your time starts okay. now. Call of Duty. Call of Duty 2. <laughs> Call of Duty 3. Call of Duty Modern War 4. Modern Warfare. Uh, 2. Modern Warfare 2. Yep. If it counts the modern one as well, 2019. Call of Duty, Call of Duty Black Ops. Call of Duty Call of Black Duty. Ops. Call of Duty. Oh shit, I clicked Black Ops 2. Pretend I clicked Black, Black Ops 2. Ops 2. I was, that was my next guess. Yeah. My next guess was <laughs> Black Ops 2. All right. Black Ops 2. Uh, Call of Duty Ghosts. Call of Duty Ghosts. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Infinite Warfare. Call of Duty World at War. Call of Duty World at War, yep. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, yep. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Modern Warfare 3. Call of Duty Vanguard. Uh, yep. Uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare, like the re the reboot. We've got Black the Ops 2. Black the Ops remake, 3. yep. Uh, you've got yeah. Black Ops 3. Yep, that's it. You did it. I mean, well done. that felt like we, I don't know any of those games. We just said numbers and advanced. <laughs> yep. That's and, like Yellowstone and, gaming model. Yep. 1923. Yep. Amazing. That's what that was. Uh, yeah, all that right. Was. That's what that was. <laughs> okay, last category. And you can get the new ones. <laughs> At the beginning of this show, I listed a series of games oh that I want God. to play this year. Was anyone paying attention? A bit, no. A little bit. A little bit. A bit. A bit. <laughs> I'd say just start with 10. That seems like a nice number. Yeah, 10. 10? Maybe. 10. Inferno? <laughs> All I can remember is one of them. <laughs> And it's because you said it funny. <laughs> I mean, we should just let them do 10. I think we challenge. I think we'll, yeah. Challenge. All right. Team Quantum. There were you the games guys... coming out, right? Is that what you were talking mm -hmm. about? Ruby talking... did say before this that she wrote an upcoming games list for this year, like today. So, um. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So it was 
basically it was games that I missed in 2023 and some upcoming ones from this year. Okay, cool. All right, here we go. Your two minutes starts now. Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. Alan Paper Wake 2? I played Alan Wake 2. Okay, Paper Mario. Alan Wake. Uh, Paper Mario, can you be more specific? Thousand Year Door. Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door is correct. Um, uh, Route 53, is it? Or 56? I can't remember the road route number. 56? I'm going to need you to be a bit more... I don't know. Um, Lies of P? Lies of P. Lies of P, yeah. Uh, um, Stray Gods? Stray Gods. Um, I suddenly I've some... forgotten everything. I regret everything. Um, 96, Road 96. Road 96 is correct. Thank you. Did you play Prince of Persia? Uh, I did not, uh, but I also don't have that on my list. Oh, sad. Uh, do you have Power World on your list? Unfortunately not. Dang it. Um, oh, oh, Luigi's Mansion remake? Luigi's Mansion 2? I played that. You didn't play the remake. It's not out yet. Don't lie to me. Oh, I, sorry. I thought you meant 3. Uh, <laughs> but no, I did not have that on my list. All right. Um, what came out last year? Uh, um... Oh my god, everything's gone. Uh, it's Foam gone. Stars? Dredge? Like Fortnite? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Destiny? Uh, god, we uh, Skull and Bones? We flew too close to the sun. Yes. Um, oh. Final Fantasy Seven. Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, I will give that to you. Oh, shoot. All right. It's like a sea of something. Uh, uh, P Princess Peach Showtime? Princess Peach Showtime. Oh, we're gonna look at a little bit. Sea of something. All right. Something. Okay, Inferno. we're jumping in. If you can get, time we got? You've, you're gonna have 30 seconds to do the last three. Okay. Okay, you ready? Your yep. time starts now. Sexy Brutal. Sexy Brutal. Alan Wake 2. I did play that. Mario Wonder. Assassin's Creed Mirage. Spider-Man 2. Cocoon. Cocoon was one of them. Starfield. Hi-Fi Rush. Hi-Fi Rush. Uh, fuck. Pikmin 4. Uh, fuck. Sea of Stars. Sea of Stars. <gasps> Good. Dang. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> shit. Oh my god. The full I'm list so of what sorry. I said was all of those. Oh my god. All I could think of was sexy brutality. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Tokyo. God. Yeah. Oh, which is on Ghostwire Tokyo, of course. Yeah. All right. We are going to take our final break of the night. And when we come back, we will find out which team won. It is, once again, ridiculously close. <laughs> <laughs> We are almost out of words from our sponsors, which uh, is one of the specific tiers we have on the Patreon. If I, think, I think the issue is like a, a sense of pressure yep. that it has to meet a certain standard. Or, it doesn't. It absolutely doesn't. Not enough pressure. Maybe you need us to, to put the pressure on to not lay it on us. thick. Sense of pressure. Yep. Sense of pressure. Yep. Sense of pressure. Yep. Pressure. Pressure. Yep. Pressure. Pressure. Yep. Pressure. 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 Yep. Pressure. Pressure. Yep. Pressure. Pressure. Yep. Pressure. 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 Yep. Pressure. 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 Pressure.
Would you like to sing the Kung Poobie song with us? Come on. Kung 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 Poobie Kung 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 Poobie Poobie here, Poobie there, Poobie everywhere. <laughs> Do you know who else plays Kung Poobie? That's right, it's Pockety. I wonder which window the Pockety is in today. Let's have a look. Is it in the round window? Or the foot window? Or is it in the Angus shitting himself window? That's right, it's in the severed foot window. We've had a lot of fun today, playing max jazz games, haven't we, Gus? We sure have, Steph. Well, it's time to go now. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Welcome back. You saw there the classic Max Jazz Games ad as well as words from <laughs> Toxicorg and Tom Harmathy, who can give me that D any day. Uh, before hey. we look at the final scores, I wanted to take this quick opportunity to thank everyone, both at Low Key and those of you who are in the audience for placing your trust in me to run the show for this month. It was a bit of a shorter one this year because uh, the, the murder mystery special also took up like a large chunk of time. But from a pure content perspective, uh, I think when I added it all up, we actually managed to deliver five episodes worth of Pocket Pals content in three. So uh, hopefully next time around the schedules will work out. We can get more of our lovely audience on screen. But regardless whether or not you were on screen this year, thank you so much for applying. Behind the I scenes... I appreciate that you had to say... Uh, we couldn't do as much because I did a murder mystery special at the same time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, behind the scenes, the existence of the content team meant that I had more time to focus on building out a, like a new framework that meant that overall everything's a lot easier to manage on my end. It doesn't involve like 15 different pieces of software Frankenstein together. Um, you can head to my channel at twitch.tv forward slash Nicrotex. I'll be applying some of those concepts to some streams of my own hopefully in the coming months, but not anytime soon because I need to sleep. <laughs> um, it's been an absolute honor to be asked to do this every year and it is always for you the community so thank you for being the amazing people that you are thank you for making this an incredible place to hang out make friends and play games but with all of that said it is time to find out the final scores and see which team won season three here we go oh. <clears throat> team inferno you guys got 118 points. Team Quantum, you ended up on 121 points. Yeah! Let's fucking go! Team Quantum yeah! takes it for season three. Well done. Congratulations. Oh my god. Oh my god. Good. And then we just add the five points for the matching costumes. And... <laughs> oh, would you look at that? No. Um, cool. Well done, everyone. Uh, that was a Ruby, very, Ruby, very. Ruby. Hang on to the other side. This side, Ruby. There you go. Oh, well yeah, done. yeah. Hold on. Uh, wait, wait, other wait, side, other wait. Other side, other side. There we Good are. game. Good game. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was a pleasure to play against you, and I'm so you glad too, I won. Oh, I'm my best friend. <laughs> I'm glad we lost because otherwise Liz would have banned us. So um. <laughs> there you go. Uh, so that's it for our show. Thanks to all of you at home for watching. Thanks to everyone here with me for participating. And thanks, of course, to the incredible content team for all of their amazing, amazing work. Before we head off, let's do final plugs. Jep, where can people find you? 
Um, so you can find me around the Discord. Um, and it's Jep on YouTube and Twitch. Um, also on Wednesdays, uh, come to the back pocket server for Halo Wednesdays. It's a good time. It's a good time. I can recommend. Um, and also if you no reveal, no big reveal this year, but um, if you watch this episode again, see how many uh, mugs I was drinking out of. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> nice. Uh, Middle C, where can people find you? Um, only on Instagram, really. Mostly on Discord. I have nothing to plug. I just want to say thank you so much. I love this community. I love you, Nick. I It's just been such a blast to be here. Thank you so much for having me. Oh, of course. Anytime. Uh, Syntax, where can people find you? Look, I have to echo the same. Thank you, Nick, and to the content team. You guys have done an amazing job, as well as everyone here. Um, I am all syntax errors on Twitch and Twitter, and you can find all kinds of random things. You can also see me around in the Fortnite Friday Discord or occasionally in the Halo Wednesday. Jump in, say hello, play some games with the community. Absolutely. Uh, Liz, where can people find you? Usually here, because <laughs> apparently I don't live anywhere else. Um, but I'm Liz Dahlia underscore. I'll be Fortnite Fridays tomorrow night. I'm on the TikTok. I'm on the Twitters. You see me around the Discord. You see me other places. So, you know, just say hi. Perfect. And I want to echo what everybody else has said. This has been absolutely fantastic. Well uh, done, it was everybody. A pleasure. It was a pleasure to have you and, and to have everyone who was on the show this year. Thank you very much to Gus and Ruby for taking the time to lead the teams tonight. I know technically you guys are still on holidays, but, well, I guess this week you're back, right? No, we're back. You're back. We're back. Yeah, so we're back. back, baby. Ruby um, is literally in the office, but we are back wearing things up at Back Pocket. Again, Nick, thank you so much for taking yeah. the keys. And yeah. the Always. panel. You have done an amazing job. Uh, these have been such a, uh, a triumph of technical wizardry, but also just getting mm. everyone involved. Um, and again, thank you to my teammates. Uh, and again, Team Quantum, well done. And all those who were in the previous teams and that kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, we're wearing Back Pocket back up. And uh, I mean, we, we have a few weeks ahead of us to get things going. So we're using that time to change things, tinker with things, add things. Uh, we're having fun uh, trying to update some stuff as well so it's going to be a big year again uh, we'll be getting more guests on we'll be having more games uh, when you said Nicrotex earlier that you'll be using these games on your channel we'll also be poaching some of those games for our channel absolutely well. we absolutely expect, we expect Anytime. nothing less <laughs> if you want to show this stuff off then we are going to poach it as well but again sure. uh, your creativity uh, always astounds so thank you so much dude and uh, yeah, no worries at all do, uh, apparently next and, Thursday and is going to be I get to, and I, I'm going to say something too Hi, uh, I just want to say, first of all, yeah, big thank you to Nick. You've actually, actually, like, absolutely just nailed it and, and knocked it out of the park. Uh, we love you. We appreciate you. You're so talented. You're beautiful. Your smile is so beautiful. You look like Linda Evangelista. Uh, amazing. Thank you so much for everything and for taking the reins and also just being your amazing self um yeah we're back uh and you can't see but i'm back at zero because i dropped something yesterday oh. so uh my highest streak was four um but as well uh next week we do not have the real actual show uh back yet our show will be back on february 1st instead the cast will be doing a Baldur's gate three string nice and it's gonna be really fun so tune in then perfect um, all of your classic characters there'll be uh ruby the smoldering what you're a, you're a bard no you're a wizard what were you um what which one were you saying i can't remember but peter's gonna be a dwarf everyone it'll be little okay. peter dwarf, dwarf peter <laughs> <laughs> and I'll be a Hell sexy burn. elf, and uh, yeah, it's gonna. Be oh yeah, and I'm a wizard. Yeah, he's a wizard. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna nice. do our playthrough that we promised in the um the uh the 12 hour stream as well so that is uh going to be in place of our episode next week so we'll be doing that for a couple of hours we'll be rolling the start of the game all doing hardcore rpg role playing with voices and things like that so it's going to be heaps of fun but then the week after that feb first we'll be back in the studio doing our first episode of the year so uh yeah keep your eyes on the channel for that Nick. perfect looking forward to it uh my name is nick belling you can follow me on twitter at nick belling or here on twitch at twitch.tv forward slash nicrotex you can also head over to my youtube channel youtube.com forward slash nick belling no at in that one if you're interested in behind the scenes stuff of a show like this got a whole three hours of that shit that you can watch uh but <laughs> it's fantastic uh with that we're gonna call it for season three of pocket pals for 2023 i think it's time we back it out 
Back it out of her own way. Yay! 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 Yay